Well, hey! Hello, howdy, how's everyone doing? Welcome back to, uh, the weekly Wednesday streams. This is weird, I haven't done this in a while. Um, yeah, how's everyone doing? We're gonna do something different today. Um, yeah. We're gonna do CDDA stuff, because I feel like you can't be a real, a real zomboid tuber until you do, do a CDDA challenge. Hello, Frank, thank you for the $5. I have not seen uh, ZOM 100 yet. I've really been watching a lot of TV in general recently. Let's go ahead. Okay, we can throw music on now. Boom. We'll do RuneScape music again because, I mean, duh. So yeah, we're going to do CDD8. It was a CDD a bit worse, or just like CDDA. Uh, it's just the scenario start. You've done CDD before? I have not done this challenge. Believe it or not. So, this will be the first time. I Like, I know the premise, and I've seen other playthroughs of it, obviously, but... I haven't done it myself yet. I guess is the way to say it. Obviously, it's a little bit different than the actual CDDA. It's just the challenge. Um, and then, obviously, we did CDDA Zombies on the member server, which was an entirely different experience. Um, I don't want to do that again. My mic is really quiet. Is it? Are we good? How's, how's my audio sound? Bump it up a little bit. exactly like most of my mornings. <laughs> just thanks, Opera. Grab curtains right away. Yeah, I figure right, because you're naked, you guys. And it's like in the winter, isn't it? So, I'm, I'm anticipating dying a lot in the beginning, but I feel like three or four runs in, we'll get one good. I have a plan, which I guess is pretty important to have. Can be difficult, but then it's just six months later. Yeah. Right, so it's the whole premise is the hardest is the start. You have a cold, you're drunk, you're deep wound. Yeah. Deep wound's in your groin, so you walk uh, with a limp. But other than that, that deep wound, I'm not really worried about patching, though. Start, please. Or I'll start whenever I want to start. No. We might just sit here for three hours. It'll be fine at first, yeah. Hardest start is the initial... Yeah, you just have to get out of the area, but I know how what we can do to get rid of that. So... I'm not, I'm not super worried about it. And stream, of course. <laughs> Alright. I did add, I guess we can go through mods real quick. This looks like a bigger list than it is. But it is still a lot of mods. Because I went through my list and I just kept adding anyone that sounded cool. So, a lot of these, I said it looks like bigger than it is because... Really, like, repairing and clothes, there's two of them. Because there's an optional mod. Things like Firearms has three to it because you have the rebalance and the patch uh inventory tooltip lag fixes a lot of qols a lot of vehicles like the trailers has three but the the general premise is i added a few towns so i added blackwood st paulo's lake ivy authentic z obviously I'm, and of course we do the old school runescape experience bar and some other qols like backpack borders better sorting more builds i added a ton of Staff's cooking, scavenger skill, wood cutting skill, a weapon condition indicator, all the all the normal stuff, really. So we'll get into it. And then I wanna go let's see, I don't really care about Doctor. Repairman, I think I might just rock this again. And I'm not gonna go prone to illness because that'll kill me. But we will go... We'll go short-sighted with... This might work, actually, as is. I'm not keen hearing either. Or amateur mechanic. Oh, it's got all these other traits because I'm stupid. We'll do this. Okay. 
I hit random earlier on, so that's what caused it. Oh, I really want to go... Um, we're going to go with a high panic build. Because we're running be uh, become desensitized. So I'm going to go high panic. And then... Weak stomach. That's going to give us enough to go... Athletic. And then our strength's just going to suck. Or we can do Stout and Fit and Speed Demon. There we go. Let's do that. Chronic Illness is fine even in CDDA. Well, aren't we, we're going to be outside naked in the cold. Well, I guess we already have a, a cold too, right? Yeah, but isn't it? It's the winter. That seems like a lot. What's going on, Alan? Do you think NBCs will benefit the game or make it cluttered? Uh, benefit, but I want an ability to turn them off. Or no, this is rough. Exa exactly, and you're going to be naked at start, because there's no guarantee we're going to get clothes. So, I'd rather just go without it. Rock something like this. We still get short blunt. Almost okay. You know, we'll, we'll do it. That's fine. But we're still going to go with a high panic build. And then I want something like inconspicuous. Or. We can do this and go athletic. And just get high up into fitness. Oh, thank you, Law. Starting off early. Thank you, sir. Thanks for the five gifts. I, I almost like this better, though. And then just deal with the strength. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do that. Oh, wait. Oh, there was Nicholas Wiener. That was a good one. I'm just looking for names right now. Wallace Bevins. It's been really good. It's a, it's 10 a.m. here for me, so it's been good so far. Got some stuff done. Um, got some behind-the-scenes stuff we're working on that we'll have an announcement for hopefully pretty soon. So, uh, gonna look out for that, but can't say anything yet. So other than that, all business side of stuff this morning. Luigi Hillard? I'm fine with this. He looks like a dog. That. Alright. Oh, is that problems with choosing traits? Yeah, it's, uh... Especially for this one, because I can't go with my a normal build that I like to run. But... I didn't... I went agoraphobic instead of... Claustrophobic. Sorry, my cat was jumping on my desk. I went I went agoraphobic instead of... Claustrophobic, because I want to be able to sleep at night. And if we go claustrophobic, that really limits where we can base up. We don't want to do that. Time to show you some integrity. All right. Pause. You're probably wondering how I ended up in this situation. Uh. Okay, not horrible. Yeah, the. Okay, so you actually just have a. Do you just have a runny nose, or is it like an instant sickness you end up with? Oh, this is going to be rotten, isn't it? Yeah, okay. I don't know if I can loop through the table without lighting on fire. Yeah, alright, we're just going to start over.
can't really get around the table. If I do a new character, it's is it gonna spawn me? Yeah, we'll have to. Oh, this is gonna be annoying. The longest to life force. <laughs> yeah, kind of, kind of defeats the purpose if you're just engulfed in flames before you uh, before you move. We'll keep going about Rimworld because your videos. Oh, nice! I'm well, glad, uh, glad I could convince you to buy it. It's a fun game. Coughing and sneezing. Oh no! What we do? We I think we did go pronouns and smoker and high thirst and slow healer and underweight. We're partying. Then we went athletic, organized, fast learner. These. And then what else did I grab? What did I grab for seven? Oh. Definitely went speed demon and stout. I have a feeling we're going to be using that a lot. Meryl Bull. Have you played or got plans to play? I don't have plans to play Solaris. I've played it before. I just... I don't really know where it fits into me. I love your 100 videos. Thanks, Nebu. Quick game of PCs. Yeah, we're done for the day. Have a good one. <laughs> What's going on, Nessie? Okay. So I just move the table. Or I could, just, I could just do this, though. And then you can, you can do quick sprints like this. And then we just gotta hope we don't. Oh, never mind. Foot's already done. We gotta go fast here. It's not gonna happen. Okay, never mind. Oh, there's one in there. That sucks. It's really hoping there wasn't gonna be. Gonna have time to loot that one either. I just need bandages. Please. Thank you. Alright, that's great too. Time to show you some integrity. I don't have time for that. Yeah, we're gonna need multiple restarts. There's a knife right there, though. Pick you. Yeah. Alright. Third time's the charm. Go upstairs and bring, what, the dozen zombies with me upstairs? PTSD. Yeah, it's gonna be like several attempts before we get a good run in. And jump? Well, I'll break my leg. Luckily, we've automated a lot of this now, so we can just do this. Boom. How do you get mods working with CDDA? There's a mod list when you select the scenario.
All right. Can I sneak? This isn't even fair. You coming that way? We're just going this way then. And then we're gonna use this fence. Come on. Oh wait. No, nothing. Okay. Please, 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 thank you. And now we just zoom this way. I think I'm just dead, right? I'm pretty sure I'm just dead. Especially from the cold. That fire at the start did me no favors. Time to show you some integrity. They're also burning the house down. I think I think I'm just dead if I Look, I think I just jump out of here and die. I'm I'm almost positive, and they're also Yeah. <laughs> There's just no chance. I just spawned in fire. Okay. First time schedule. Oh nice. Well welcome, Chase. Sorry that this is your first one. What's the next day? No, they come out every Friday, Mitchell. Yeah, I just kind of walked. Yeah, it spread into the tile I was walking on. Don't stub your toe. Yep. All right. Just the hundred seconds of credit stump. It's hardest challenge. <laughs> Everything is just casually placed. Yeah, it's a little, little messy. All right, all right. So I'm just actually fucked in this one. There's just no exit. This game hates me. There's literally just no. There's just no exit. I'm just stuck here. Like, what is this? Like, come on. No, not today. Two exists. Well, each room was on fire. There, were, there was four rooms. All four of them had fire in them. It was a literal single tiled start challenge. But with fire. <laughs> this is like the. I want to go to a. Uh... We'll load up the saves after this, and I just want to see how many we go through. Like, we'll I'll do it at the end of the stream. We'll just count how many we're at. All right. It's like four or five now. Bill Barnhart? Sure. Is your character wet and cold or on fire? Because they don't seem like something that can close. Well, you could be soaking wet uh, on your... On your chest and like on fi your legs are on fire. This is the optimal start. I'll tell you what. No, it's not. I lied. Pause. Alright, just. We're just gonna rip this out right away though. Oh, wait. No, all that's definitely burnt. Can we be sneaky here? No, definitely can't. There's one behind me, but... Please. You fall. You fall. Thank you. Okay. We're up, we're up to something here. Please. 
Give me something. Okay. Just get clothing on. Do I really only have that sucks? Okay. I don't know the exact place I need to be going, but I know a general vicinity. That sewing kit has no needle in it. That sucks. It's not gonna be anything I can take in here, is there? No. Okay. We're just gonna go this way. Oh, they're in there too. Oh, we might. Wait, I want that sweater. I need this one to break. Hold on. You can just come on in, buddy. Thank you. And then we're gonna hop out. Bye! We just need to run this way for a long time. Anything we see that, uh, ha well, the cough is going to pull a lot of zombies, actually. But and we don't have any weapons. We have water. But the cold is going to kill us. We need a needle. But more importantly, we need to do this. Oh, law again. Thank you, sir. I appreciate it. Head into the farm. Yeah, exactly. That's that's kind of the, the game plan, right? We can get to the farm... It's far enough away from zombies that we can at least get our bearings and then make runs into like Cortland Medical. So we need health first. I don't I don't care if uh Well the needle's actually kind of a big deal, but I am gonna keep grabbing those clothes though so we can rip them up. Yeah, let's get sobered up. Let's. I mean, we're, we have our hypothermic already, too, so. I want you to know I was like mid sneeze when I opened that door, not expecting this guy to be in here. Okay, we have weapons now. I feel like there's gonna be oh they're all dead great take the denim shirt the long socks what are the baggy jeans like to what we have now is there any difference not really okay if we can find like a leather jacket we're in business The clean rags aren't going to help at all, but I want to have them. And then we can fill both of these. Well, never mind. I'm just not going to remove that that uh, bandage because it's just going to kill me. No holes in the other jeans. Oh, good looks. Very true. Sweatshirt is good. What about this t-shirt? Right, so take anything we can get here, and then we'll rip all this up. Because... We can do this. Oh, we need scissors. We can make thread. And then we'll just need a needle. Tweezers. More tweezers. Not very useful. We're also going to keep... The gas can, because we can put water in it. Boil water for regs while the power's out. It's six months later. Take the pipe wrench. Beta blocker's going to be pretty useful. There's just booze up here, but I can't grab it. Or is that... 
cologne and perfume. They just gave it the the booze treatment. Please, someone just have a needle up here. We're not gonna have one. No. Okay. That sucks. I have two pairs of tweezers and lipstick in the bathroom. Yeah, it is a little strange. I don't judge. I think that's basically everything we can... Yeah, because they don't have a... Oh, they do have a side room. Sheets aren't really going to matter for right, right now. Right wrist. Don't need the dirty rags. So those can go back. I'm going to leave this here. And... I'm going to leave the pipe wrench here. Do the primary. Okay. I don't really need tweezers either. Where is that zombie? Oh, we swing so slow because we're hypothermic. Taking you, though. The lumberjack shirt would be great for wind resistance, but it's shredded, so that kind of blows. Okay, let me you make an improvised bag with sheets. What mod would that be? That'd be kind of cool, though. Okay, hold on. Let's do this. I want to wash his clothing because I have very finite amount of time and water. Because there's no power. So I have 20 time water so per faucet, tech. 20 water per toilet, and like 200 in a bathtub. I don't want to waste any of that water washing clothes. Trying to think of how I can get to Cortland. Otherwise, isn't there... Well, there's a bar and there's a warehouse to my west. But there's not going to be a, a sewing kit there, is the problem. Let's go see. I want to see how bad the trees are over here, too. And this is what our stats are, by the way. And the issue with Cortland Medical is I don't know if I'll be able to get out if I actually get there. But we'll do a... Uh, it's like a very quick looting run. I have cat's eyes, so I'm not too worried about nighttime. As much as I am uh, getting tired. But yeah, we definitely we need food still too, so a looting run is necessary. Oh, that's a big group. Medical office is very risky. Yeah, but it's the only place I know that'll have suture needles. Otherwise, I'm just kind of going house to house. With uh, insane pop zombies. And hoping I can find a needle. And I swing slow. Oh, I guess I'm not hypothermic anymore, which is nice. We get in here. We can gonna come behind me Need to go here really quick take that Ooh, hold on a Rio no 
let's save that for tonight. Shirt's worn. There's one in here, but, uh, oh, let's shut this. I need food. Yeah. Actually, I probably run faster than Oh, no, because I can't dash. Alright, the only needles I'm going to find here are going to be used. So I'm not really going to spend time here. I'll take you, though. whole stick of butter. Oh, yeah. Where they come from? I'm pulling them when I sneeze or cough. Call you live. Well, hello. Yeah, I'm starting uh, weekly streams again on Wednesdays. And then we're doing... I'm going to start streaming community events again, too, which is always going to be a fun time. I wonder if I'm actually... The farm is clearly the safest place, but I wonder if I can actually hold up in one of these houses. Or uh, if I can get to the rusty rifle, I can get booze at least, which is gonna... If nothing else, it's gonna help me get my weight up. Well, there's gonna be so many of them over here. I think if we're going to die, it's going to be at Cortman. So it's my health, but yeah. Hasn't really moved, and we're going to start to heal with uh, once we get some food in us. But I don't have enough food to heal a sickness, like a, an extreme sickness, especially with prone to illness and the fact that we're just out here running around. I don't really ever have a chance to lose these guys either. I wonder if I can... No, not even gonna try. Okay, it's down one more road, isn't it? Because that's like the fruit stand. So we have one more road to go. Keep hobbling along. If we approach this like they're all sprinters, it's uh, a little bit easier because you just... Oh, that sucks. I was really hoping that was going to happen. Never mind. I was going to say, we can use the fencing, but uh, if I'm just going to keep wiping out... Time to show you some integrity. Oh, they are right there. I don't know if I can do this and get away with it. But I do need food. Yeah, that's gonna get me killed. Shit. Can I... What's in here? Just a bedroom. We are gonna do this actually. Give me something good. Nothing. Oh, it sucks. Okay. Time to show you some integrity.
Oh no, and we're exerted. I gotta stop dashing then. Or, hold on, I have a plan. We're gonna do this. Okay, thought I would be able to get way more, and I tripped again. And I lost my garbage bag. Who am I bleeding from? Yeah, we might just be dead. See if we can do something here, because we also went smoker too, so oh there's just an army in here. Okay. That's cool. Now we just gotta hope most of them get in before that door breaks. Please. Please. Keep going. I'm dead. We take it. <laughs> we'll take it. Let's just get the hell out of here. Try and cure the cold. Yeah, but we need food to cure the cold. But yeah, I agree. This is a bad idea to try day one. Just dash through them. Go. The Jukes. He can't be stopped. I'm just gonna end up pulling all of these back to the farm with us. That's the problem. No! <laughs> I walked right into him! Oh, we had such a good run going. Not really. We made it halfway through the first day. Okay, but that's the general strat we're gonna do. That's the general strat. Okay, I do want to see this. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Big Fs. Oh, well. It is what it is. Got all day. You fought all the zombies off. We believe in you. Oh, thanks, Nat. <laughs> Good to see you. How did you survive that? Yeah, I got really lucky with that jump. Because if you saw one did do that bite animation, it just didn't register because I, I must have, like, slid off of him. Got very lucky. You know how to wire a generator book or is electrician value one enough? Uh, you, need, you need a magazine to do the generator and we also need fuel. Morbs, what I've been doing to make characters is putting on every single bad and good trait and then just canceling out. Oh, that's a good strat. I like that idea. What is... Okay, not the worst thing in the world. Definitely, we've had worse starts. But in order to move, I need to pick you up. Thank you. Set you down over here. Thank you. All right, so long. Oh, and he's got a mullet, though, so I feel like we'll, we'll do much better this time. Well, there's also, like, no zombies here. Never mind. There are definitely zombies here. Oh, wait. He's stealth. He's stealth. He's stealth. He's stealth. Give me your clothes. Please. Thank you. I 
will take anything I can throw on right now. And then we're going to rip you up. And then I don't care. We'll remove the glass later. They're like in that room, aren't they? Are you kidding me? We got three. Oh, that's such a cock tease. Okay. We do need food, though. We have can openers, so... In this instance, I am just going to try and uh, get the hell out of here. Shut you real quick. Okay. If we can find... Wait, what did you have on you? No jacket. We need to find one with a jacket. None of these do. Alright, immediately go into the farm then. Uh, he's got a sweater on him, but there's... Oh, actually, hold on. We won't be able to do this here. Pull you. Come on. Nope. I might just be dead here. Okay. Yeah, too many of them to, uh... Try to single one out. Unless... Oh, it's ripped, too. Yeah, not worth it. Let's just get out of here. And then we're just going to hope we get lucky and find like two zombies around here. It's the second time there's been one in here. I think that's probably good enough for now. Wrench will take. Don't really need any of these. Anything cool in here? Another wrench. That one sucks, but... Uh, I'm not going to use that because I want that hammer, but we'll take Shitty Wrench. Someone's in here, too. Okay, where are you now? Right there. Oh, there's two of you. Good thing I swing slow as shit. Oh, I'm just not going to be able to. Okay. There we go. We need to separate you. Okay, this isn't working. I just want to push. Get out of my inventory. Just need one of you to fall. Thank you. That's all I needed. Literally all I needed. Vitamins will take. Towel we can take too. Let's do that real quick. Okay, maybe a good thing we're staying out of the rain then. Pants. Pants are nice. Duffel bag. Okay. A crash helmet. We kind of got incredibly lucky here. I'm assuming jeans are going to be better than pants, right? Yeah, jeans are way better than pants. Throw you back in there.
Time to show you some integrity. That's rotten. Another can opener. Okay. Now they can't. It's wearing the red, white, blue. Oh, hell yeah. It's America's birth month. Can I? I feel like we need, uh, not, what do we need? A nail and a knife. And we can craft a needle. Time to show you some integrity. Let's go find him. For his and Jesus, of course. Music, risky music is a staple in Presbyterian. Yeah, it's, I've been having a lot of fun with it. Living the Rinsky music. Yep, of course, of course, of course. Gotta have it. Okay, and then to cure sickness, we basically just gotta hang out, be warm, be fed. I'm gonna throw a new shirt on, actually. Is there a difference between denim jeans and baggy jeans? Actually, yeah. Okay. We're gonna rock denim for the insulation. Gotta stay warm out there, people. I was already in here. Okay. It's not worth going out because it's raining anyway. Let's... Just hang out and kind of... Oh, you know what? Place you. Place you. Let's remove glass. And just keep that from bleeding right now. Oh, and I don't even have painkillers, though, so I'm just not even going to be able to sleep. Never mind. We can't even do this. But we're... Are we actually getting cured, or did I only ever just have the sniffles? Oh, hell yeah. Well, I guess we'll just wait. Here, we'll slam one more thing of food. Perfect. All right. Cured. I don't think vitamins do pain, do they? No, they just do fatigue. Okay. Cortman is like way over here. There's a warehouse up here, but we're not gonna find a needle in a warehouse, right? Not cured yet, yeah. Come back because the moodle goes away before the cure. Uh Ooh, see, the more you know about being sick. Do you have any PZ tips for beginners? I have two 101 tip videos for beginners. So 202 tips. Just need a nail and a knife, right? Need sleep tablets? All good, all good. I need a knife too. So, unless I have, I have a hammer. We need nails, but yeah, we can disassemble for that. And then we... And then we oh, wait, but hold on. Will a, a bread knife work? No. A bread knife will not work. Okay. Still not the end of the world. Because... Well, let's just dump some of this off real quick. Don't need you. We're going to keep the hammer. Can open. Oh, you know what? Let's go ahead. Can I make a key ring? Or no, I'm assuming I need something else for that. Where is that hammer? Putting all that in a duffel bag. Same with the can opener. Same with the vitamins. Okay. And we are moving. Yeah, so we, we literally... 
let's make sure I can do a kitchen knife first. Yeah, okay, so we can use a kitchen knife. Okay. All we need then. There's one more canned food in that storage. Okay. We'll grab that on we'll grab that once we come back. How bad do you think that neighborhood's gonna be? If we uh did I bring the towel on me or did I leave that? Probably should have brought that with me. see what we can do here. On the bright side, it's raining in the middle of December, which uh, has never happened by me before, but... I'm just going to hug the fencing here. Hop over. And now we zoom. That's the burnt down house. This fire's still going on. I keep forgetting I'm not sick any- like I'm not sneezing and stuff. Nope. Go somewhere else. Like over here, where it's nice and safe. We get one. I don't think a butter knife worked. I know the bread knife didn't. Take that energy drink, though. This is the hoodie. Oh, the sweater is way better than the hoodie. Okay, we're gonna keep you though. Can we stealthy? No, we can't. But I want that jacket. Okay, if we can just get a kitchen knife, we'll be totally fine. Come on. Not enough time. Oh, the door was open the whole time. Kitchen knife, kitchen knife, kitchen knife, kitchen knife. Nothing. We are very unlucky. All these doors are unlocked, though. Did you guys, have you guys noticed that? Nope. Not gonna go that way. Oh, wait. Are we just kind of... All right, this is gonna be dumb. Oh, I'm not gonna be able to do it. Hold on. I might just die here. Yeah, I'm just dead. <laughs> oh, that fucking blows. Okay. Damn, really thought we had that one. I thought there was a window on the north, uh, north side of the box. There was not. It's okay. We have the strat down now. We have the, uh... The method, the methodology. Big Fs, I know. Big Sag. It's okay. Yeah, I thought I was. I was really hoping the bathroom was gonna have a window, or there was a window by that box on the north. There was not. There was not. We can go with John Wick, or Wan Jick. Knock, knock, it's death. Stone knife? Uh, we were not going to be able to forge anything in the rain. Yeah, give me just a second here. The deaths? Yeah, it's going to happen, though, early on. It's all good. 
Okay. Through the trees is a shed and a small house. Oh. Oh, Chef Nano, thank you for becoming a member. Do they all know where you're at? No, I was coughing and sneezing for a while, though, so I'm sure that didn't help. I think I might just be dead here, too, unless I can squeeze past. No. Barely on fire, right? But where's the burn? My right shin. I'm just kind of screwed now, though, because I'm never going to be able to run. So many zombies right there. See how fast I can get in here. Sewing kit has nothing in it, of course. A jacket, so... Not... The worst thing in the world? Orange soda will take that, though. I was really hoping we could get just one right here. Like this guy. Need your shoes, sir. Please. Please. Oh no! I give up. <laughs> that fire was BS. That's how, like, most, except for that very last one we just did, were. Like, ever, I think, I think at least four of these, it started where the fire was just, like, this one, the fire was in every single room. The only tiles that weren't on fire were in the kitchen. it really hard to get start okay so your whole house is on fire right you're drenched like completely soaking wet you're black you're blackout drunk like you're as you, you basically all your negative moodles are maxed on start except for depression that's how it starts oh and you have glass shards in your balls it is a very fun challenge like the it's supposed to be incredibly difficult at the start We're gonna go with Leaky Bum. Again, with the worst fire options possible. I'm gonna get lit on fire again. Yep. And so, okay, for those that don't know, burns last, without slow healer, last like three to four in-game days if you maintain them and keep them clean. And we don't have any clothes or anything either, so it's just like... Okay. Maybe off to a little bit of something here? We can get shoes right over there. Please, give me shoes. Denim shirt, t-shirt, socks, baggy jeans. Wear that, rip you. Let's take the glass out. Did I not just rip? It just didn't give me anything. Okay. Give me some vitamins. We'll take it. I might... I'm still... I think I might just be dead, though. I don't have anything. Well, I guess I can... Do that. Let me get to the fence over here. Bandage those up. Okay. As long as the one that's on fire doesn't walk over him, we can go back and grab some of this stuff. If there's time. I don't know. If, eh, there's not going to be time. Oh, this sucks. Okay. Let's, uh... If we could just keep getting these single ones, I mean, that'd be the worst thing. Take the socks. Can I... No, I can't even shred the dress. That just doesn't give me anything. That's so annoying. Oh, and then we're going to start dying from hypothermia, too. Let's 
16 times on yeah it's insane pop settings see it is uh it's this it's the six months later preset with all this So you start in December, insane pop zombies, no water, no power, uh, plastered, severe pain, dying, nasty cold, with glass shards in your in your uh, in your taint. Yeah, if you guys want to know the full settings, it. So obviously you have like the the start, but it's the six months later preset. The tainted shards, start. yeah, that's the worst part of it, because then you have this limp, and then the uh, to make it even worse, we started for the second time in a row with with no way out except to walk through fire. So then you walk through fire, and uh, now now you have a burn on your foot. Hope there's one in here. Or that the door's locked. Uh, neither of those are worth it. A wrench will take. Don't really care for a screwdriver right now. I want to get inside though, because we're dying from hypothermia. We're over here. Are we wearing jeans? Baggy jeans. All these conditions suck, though. That's a window. Where are you hiding? Awesome! Break my windows. Thank you. Now we look cool, though. I don't think we're ever going to get as lucky again as finding, uh, finding, like, everything we could possibly need in here. What makes this the hardest start? Okay. You spawn in a house that's on fire. So scroll back like five minutes into the stream and watch that. House is on fire. So you have to get burns to leave, i.e. the burnt foot. You spawn naked with max drunkness, a nasty cold. You're bleeding and you have no clothes. So you have nothing to patch the injury. Uh, it's the six month later preset. So insane pop zombies. It's also December 9th. It's 40 degrees inside the house. So, very, very diff- it is, it is the most difficult start you can- you can have with a preset. And glass yeah, and you have glass shards shoved into your balls. But it- it-, it that being said, we do have mods on here. There is a mod list for this. And I think this is honestly our worst start where we've made it out of the house. Because we we weren't able to take any items when we left. So I think this is the first time we like don't have something to drink by walking outside. I will take that hoodie, though. We're not dying from hypothermia anymore. Just so, oh, is that? Hold on. Did we get lucky here? Oh, I thought that was a jacket. Okay. And 
we can't even eat our way out of this, like last time. Hunting or camping event nearby? We'll do like a quick loop. I don't want to stay out here too long though because we're... There, Mick. Where'd you do the camping event? Nothing over there. We find a pipe or something. I have a wrench for now, but that's uh, still the uh, the hypothermia is gonna kill me. The scarecrow. Oh, good looks. Look at you guys saving my life. The rifles and shotguns are useless, but we want stuff like this. Not the shirt. We'll keep the boots again. Thank you. Yeah, the rifle... I mean, we'll collect the rifles for now. But the vest will help, at least with hypothermia. Take the campfire. Ah, oh, it's so much work. Well, the, so we're warm enough right now that if we stay inside, we lose the hypothermia. But we don't have food to, like, recover. Or to help recover. Someone said there's a, a building to the north. So we can go explore that. As long as it's not raining or anything. But with the vest... So before, I needed to hold shift and, like, keep bouncing like this. Like, I needed to dash. And that was to basically prevent hypothermia. Uh, with this, now we don't need to do that. How, how's our swing? I don't think I'm going to be able... Hold on. Let's bring them back to the farm. We're going to use the fence. No! <laughs> I need them to not go separately like that. They need to stay on the same tile. I'm just getting my ass kicked by these guys. Okay. Come on. Come this way. I really needed them to stay on the same tile. It's gonna happen again, too. Yep. Loop this way. Where did they go? Alright, they're figuring it out. Very slowly. That one just didn't... Okay, they're just not going to do that. That sucks. Very... Yeah, it's just not going to work. Yep, okay. You need them to stay on the same tile so that you can step on top of them. And they don't lunge like that. Because well, as soon as they lunge, you just get knocked over. Tactical zombies. I know they had, <laughs> they had the strats. They had the strats. Why are the furrow textures broken? I don't know. That's the devs. They'll figure it out one day. It's only been ten years. Alright, one more time for the build. 
Look good. We're all good. All right. We'll do Walter. We'll do Walter White. Okay. This is a good start. It's probably the best start we've ever had. And we got lard. And a bath towel. Can I do this without, uh... Being burned. There we go. Okay. Probably the best start we've had. In terms of a house. Oh, wait. Hold on. We're gonna press luck here. Give me your clothes. Give me your clothes. Come on. You. 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 And then actually, instead of the socks, we're going to rip you. Come on. Come on. All right, let's get out of here. Ooh, a motorcycle. I, think I can use that thermos. I can, okay. Want you? Oh, it's destroyed, but this isn't. No! <laughs> Oh, there's- oh, I fucked up big time. Nudge past. Oh, I super fucked up. Oh, I super- oh, and then I had inertia movement. <laughs> no. If you guys don't know what inertia movement is, it was that. Where you just continue what running. What would zombie apocalypse happened right now? Oh, what would I do if a zombie- oh, thank you for the donation. I don't know. Panic? Mass panic, probably? Yeah, if you wanted to see what, z what uh, in movement inertia looked like in real time, that was that. Where you just kind of continue running in one direction even though you weren't even touching a key. There's zombies that you do, probably. I think that, uh, if I, what I would do if I ha if it happened right now, we have a, a cooler in the garage. I'd go uh, load that up with water, and then I would put that. We have a, a two. We actually just bought a bunch of cases. My daughter's birthday's this weekend, so we're doing like a little house party for it. So I'd go grab all of the water. We had two two big cases of water bottles in the garage. I'd go take those. I would grab all of our canned food. And I would throw that in our car. And then I would go up and I would text two of my friends that I own a campsite with up north. And then we would go to that campsite. I don't think I'm going to be able to, to win this fight. Okay, stand. I need one of them to stand. Yeah, no. Okay. Didn't stand a chance. Let's loop and go this way. Excuse me, coming through. Are you kidding me? It's burnt down? <laughs> Dog, this game fucking hates me.
The whole farmhouse is just gone. Oh, that's so depressing. The shotguns, though, which, uh, are gonna do way more harm than good right now. Oh, that sucks, dude. Alright, is there anything left in here? Anything. Anything at all. No. Entire building just gone. Oh, wait. I'm taking your water. Oh, this sucks. Can I get up here at all? Anything? No. Alright, let's go... Is there a tent over here still? Or no, was that just the event? A little camping trip gone awry. Alright. There's the building. We don't have a... This is gonna suck. Can I... Let's pull them out real quick. Nothing, okay. He's got a gun. See, a shotgun is only gonna make the matter, like, make the situation way worse. I can't, I can't fight them well with melee. Cause I'm not, I, cause the groin injury is not gonna let me conga line them. But if we can ball them up, is there real quick? Is there a window in the back there? There is. Okay. You guys want to see some fucking strats right here? Come on. Come on. Okay. Is that all of them? Watch. Don't need anything else. Okay. That bought me enough time to do one thing, and this building had nothing of importance in it. So. This sucks. Push them to death? Of course. Usually streams one day. Yep, yep. Restarted streams on Wednesdays. Okay. Let me consult the Zomboid map. We can go to the relay station. There's not, gonna, there's not gonna be any food up there. We can go east towards Crossroads. There's a cabin in the woods. If I can... If I can lose them in the trees here, we'll forage for a little bit. Because if all I need is a hammer, I, a hammer seems to be much easier to find for us right now than nails. Go to the cabin in the woods. Yeah. Let's let's do that. The issue is we don't really have... Oh, wait. We can open them with a screwdriver, can't we? Hell yeah. Okay. Screwdriver's the best pickup. Yeah, let's start making our way to the cabin then. Went to the relay station. Yeah, the relay station's fenced in. Cabin in the woods, on the other hand. Not fenced in. But, uh... Probably a little... S Actually, I don't even know if it'd be safer. Let's go see if we can get lucky here. We have cigarettes, don't we? Yeah. We're just gonna keep pulling every zombie, though. Where? Can I lose them if I just keep doing this? Okay. We're gonna do my least favorite thing in this game. I can actually do this pretty well passively. 
or we're just not going to find anything because, you know. Can you guys imagine walking into a wilderness like this and not finding, like, a single stick? Reese, I want your sweatshirt. Never mind, no I don't. You, on the other hand, I want your shirt. I don't really care about you. Oh, that's a whole group. Oh, it's a Warren, though. Never mind. Gross. Look at this big bitch. Why are there just, like, a, a random pack? Oh, because we're on the road. Pause. <laughs> Where is the road? We need to go this way. Please just give me a stick. Just something. Alright. Oh, wait, hold on. What did we see? A pine cone. Wow. Take that. There it is. Am I not gonna be able to Oh, I've that's that sucks. What? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Good. Great pathing. Whose cabin is this? Ben's cabin. Thanks, Ben. Fishing tackle. Half the stuff needed to make a tent. A toilet. Anything useful? No? All right, let's, uh, what are we looking like? I mean, the injury is going to be the worst, but. Um, let's see if we can at least keep working away at that. Is it going to continue to go away? No. We're going to eat all of our food. And I can't smoke a cigarette yet, can I? Yeah. Come on. At this point, it's 7.30. How bad is it to even attempt to... Yeah. We have a stone. We can chip that stone. I'm not going to be able to sleep, though, because of my pain. sponge in there. I'm gonna put a t-shirt in there. Why do I have so many dish towels? Why does it say... I don't know. I don't care. He died a lot. Yeah, I think it's seven. Six or seven times. Going insane shooting zombies with a stick. He hasn't seen anything he would... <laughs> Can we just kind of speed up time until we're not in severe pain, or are we just kind of fucked? I feel like we're just kind of fucked. Park Ranger really comes in handy? Yeah, I can see that.
You say Dave, but he's still there, right? <laughs> My brother, age five, doesn't drink any blood. I don't know. He's not a doctor. Bitten? No, glass shards on my balls. And I can't sleep from the glass shard. Actually, I think we took it out. Yeah. It is infected, though, which is a little concerning. And I keep falling over that. Also, a little concerning. That was all the water we had, huh? Yeah. Oh, can we do it yet? Can we do it yet? Can we? Yeah, there's like nothing we can do out here. And he's hungry again. Oh my god, and we ate all the food to get rid of the sickness. I don't think there's no water even remotely near us either to go fishing. Are you full-time? I went full-time in February. Yep. Before that, I was uh, a, a sock analyst in the cybersecurity sector. Highly recommend cybersecurity, though, as a career if you're interested in that. Yeah, that's what I did before this. We just basically need to keep waiting until I'm too exhausted, and then I'm going to wake up at, like, noon the next day. Is that going to work? Do we have enough now? No. Eventually, it's going to overtake the pain. It's just going to be the next day before we do that. How bad is it? I don't know if that's worth sleeping until like 7 p.m. Anything to dig with my hands. I mean, on the bright side, there's not really anything around us. There's a, I mean, there's a trailer park to our... Like, that's going to get us killed. Like, I can do... The trailer park to our east here. But we're, we're tired, we're depressed. I mean, the depression is just going to come from no smoking. We aren't sick anymore, so we actually might be able to... Oh, hold on. There's a couple in there. Can I just... No. Well, we can do this one. Yep, come on. Oh, but we're so tired, it's... Yeah. Didn't I have, or was that... Definitely. Oh, well, we can grab food through here. Give me all of it, and then I'll leave you alone. I promise. Actually, I'm not. I'm definitely going to explore this a little bit more. It's just going to take forever. Oh, they have some on the outside now. Okay. Shut you. Hi, how are you? Fall over. All over. Thank you. Is there only one left? It's the Alex Jones fan uh, fan club in here. Anything useful in here. Oh, that sucks. On the bright side, we're going to keep filling up water. We're not going to have to worry about that. That exhaustion isn't going to go away. Sleeping tablets are huge. 
don't really care about magazines right now. Energy drink is big. This is all huge. Yeah. Oh, hold on. Can I be sneaky here? No, of course not. How bad does being tired affect? It doesn't. Awesome. Let's just get home then. Is it always infected? I don't think it is, and it just becomes infective, especially because we have like prone to illness and slow healer. And we're not, you know, we're not gonna be able to patch that for another day or so, at Time least. Show you some integrity. Let's, I mean, let's just capitalize on the depression. And just get our weight up. Dump all of our food in here. Dump the sleeping tablets. Energy drink, the beer can will be nice because we'll be able to use it to, get, to bypass the pain. Yeah, let's just dump all this in here for now. Really don't need any of that. Even... Oh, this is empty, actually. So. Even that, though, we don't need. Okay. We really need a stick. But we'll take the twigs, because we're going to use those to uh, get our antique oven up and running. Anything. Come on. Gotta be something here. I don't think we can do anything. We can make a campfire kit. But I don't need a campfire, though. So we have, the, again, the antique oven will kind of get us through the winter. Cars of window through them. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's actually a really good idea. I never thought to do that. That's super... I always was just like, fuck it, I'll break it. how slow like nimble is gonna be because i didn't do any boosted xp for that that is just gonna be an absolute pain in the ass we're not gonna touch berries because we don't know what's uh good and what isn't yo well actually we didn't really need a tree branch did we because we have... Well, why do we need... No, we need a chipstone and a tree branch for a knife. So we did. Okay. Now we just need a hammer and a nail. I'm going to throw these in here for now. And then we'll use the twigs to actually light the fire. Once we get something to use it with. But we don't need a knife. And it's already 11. We're... This is going to suck. I don't want to forge for the rest of the day. I feel like we're going to have to. Pine cones are good tinder. Okay. Our 30 minutes. Oh, damn. All right. Well, we'll forge for the rest of the day then. As boring as that sounds. More berries. Worst case, we can use the tree branches to get some spears going, too. So we're going to need some... But I, again, we can't really use... Like, combat isn't viable right now. Unless it's only a few zombies that we can knock over. Oh, that's so depressing. We'll be fine. 
not touching any berries. So I want to take advantage of some of the time because we're going to sleep for 12, 12 or so hours. at one o'clock get another eye over here and know is that just fading yeah cleaning the bandages or are you just gonna I'm just gonna go with the dirty one because I have a deep wound so there's no sense in me cleaning it because it's not going to do anything. It's already infected. So I need I need to stitch it, but I need Time to show you some thread and do we not have thread right? We can do this though. Oh, maybe we can. I'm going to destroy that bath towel. Okay. Clean the rags for five and we can make thread boom okay and now all we need is a hammer but we need a regular stone what do we need for a stone hammer we might be able to do this and then we just need nails time to show you some integrity and we need a regular stone okay Let's go find a regular stone. We're probably not going to find one, but if we can just find a regular stone, even though I know I just chipped one, which uh, wish I would have realized before. Stone pile. The one time I don't want to chip stone. Give me something here. There we go, we're in business now. What's over here? Alrighty, now we just need nails. We just gotta get a little lucky here. Cut one nail, we'll take it. And, okay. Where's our hammer? Is it in here? Or is it just on the ground? Craft a needle. There we go. Now we have a needle. And we have our thread. Remove the bandage. And we can stitch that bad boy up. We'll clean a rag. And slap some rip sheets in there. And there we go. And now our groin is healed. And there we go. Now, we kind of just have to play the waiting game. But we have enough food that that's really not going to matter. Let's go to bed here. And just like that, now all we have is severe crippling depression.
Alrighty. What are we at weight-wise? Still 72, but we're going up. Okay. Keep the we gotta keep the weight on. Go back up to twice. And I don't have a lighter. I think I need. Yeah, we need planks. Take a book though. Scrap wood and let's put you in there. Okay. What I'm thinking. How are we moving now? We're just normal okay, we're just normal walking. So wait till like 4:30. I need I need planks so I can make a uh, a notched wooden plank so I can light fires without a like a lighter or matches right now. Come on, okay. Do that. I don't need to be incredibly stable, but I want to go start looting. Because now at least we can move. And I can use the stone hammer as a weapon, even though I'm not going to right now. But we need we need more clothing. We need a belt. And uh, we need to start looting stuff. I need a bag, too. See, I have a saw. I do not have a saw. Time to show you some integrity. So I probably should have crafted a spear for this, but oh well. Time to show you some integrity. On the bright side, we can run again, which is perfect. On the negative side, I didn't go any any boosts in nimble, so I I run and I. I can't really, like, fight zombies in a conga line. It's a lot of jewelry. Scissors, though, we'll take that. Hunting knife, of course, as soon as I get everything fixed up, we get knives. Is the passenger seat unlocked? No. Ooh, but you have a shovel. And a sickle. in here. No. Okay. How many? Four. One just hopped into here. No, he's just not gonna... Hi. Okay, you do that. I'm gonna go over here. Oh, shit. This is gonna take forever.
Never mind. Did not take forever. All their clothes are just so destroyed, which I guess is part of the six months later start. Ooh, we'll take you, though. If we... Can I just ignore... If I can just ignore them and keep moving. It's a large group. Did not work how I was hoping it was going to work. <laughs> Meh. Thank you. Come on. Awesome. Let's get the fuck out of here. The shovel's gonna be great if we can keep using it to do that. One to my left. Yep. Oh, okay. Gotta love it. Let me just completely miss. Oh, and it's a neck laceration, too. Let's just slap a dirty rag on there. And just like that, our adventure's over. He's got food on him, too. Come on. No, I wanted that hunting knife. Uh, I'm not going to change that yet. It might get me killed. Time, go. See how far off we are. This way. All 
All right, now we gotta wait and see how deadly that uh, scratch was, or that neck laceration was. But on the bright side, we got a headhunter rifle I'm probably not gonna use. So that can just go like, right on, I don't know, the floor right there. Don't need a needle anymore. I'm gonna keep that wrench. The shovel? Well, we'll just keep that for there for now. I'm happiness. We have more food. A pack of cigs. Do we look cool? All right. Yeah. What? What's the current stream music? Ah, oh, RuneScape. RuneScape all the way. Do you regain health when you eat? Yes. Uh, it, it boosts your healing. You die from having an infected wound. I play in bites only. Yeah. Um. There's a chance, a percentage chance, based on if it's a laceration or, or someone walking out here. Uh, based on if it's a laceration or a scratch. There he is. Where the hell did he go? Is he just hanging out in these trees? No? He's despawn? Alright. Bye. I think we just gotta wait right now, though. Oh, perfect. Came to us. Sorry, someone was at our door like an hour ago. Our doorbell went off. Seeing who it was. Take that. We'll rip all those. Oh, they're all kind of just... Oh, cowboy hat, though. Get out of my way. Move. Move. Another one behind me, too. Where are all of you coming from? Anything? There's just, they just keep coming. Just keep coming. It's a bad spot to be.
Oh, we're on times two speed right now. That was almost bad. Did I miss something? Like, where the hell were they all coming from? So I'm gonna take off the next one. Isn't the polo neck is better though? Yeah, substantially. Anything crafting is going in here. Anything clothing is going to go in the second one, which I think... Is, oh, it's just empty. Perfect. And then tools can go in here. One with ammo. Again, I'm just going to toss you in the fire pit for now. Sleeping pills next to the bed. Books can go in here. Same with those cans for now. Alright, I think we're in the clear. This is going to be infected, but not really anything I can do. Oh, I don't want to toss those in there. I'll keep those. Okay. And it's raining. I don't want to go out. Let's get our weight back up. Perfect. I think we'll just wait until tomorrow until it stops raining. Does YouTube have a Roblox chat filter now? What? Yeah, I got blocked. Oh. I don't have any filter. I think I only have filters on like three words. Drunk is not included in that. That's dumb. Pot outside for rainwater? Ah, uh, yeah, that's true. We still need something to be able to like... We still need a plank. But yeah, that's a good idea, actually. That one's got water in it already. But the tin cans we can use. Thermos actually catch it too, or no? I don't think the thermos can. Ooh, hello. Did all of those zombies from the... Uh... The trailer park, like, follow me back here? I... They just keep showing up. A bread knife in your back, it looks like. It's got jerky, though. Like... Where are they? they? Yeah, they've got to have just followed me from here. Oh, their clothes are destroyed, too. Fine, because we're farming cigarettes, but it's just strange. What's going on, Odd Dev? How you doing, man? Yeah, I don't. They must have followed me. Like that's so far to follow, though, because they're not migrating over here. 
No. Oh, well. Either, I mean, it's fine either way, but it's not the end of the world. I really want to wait, though. Can you do something with gold pieces? No. Not with the mods I have. I'd rather not get banned, Danny. What did I miss? <laughs> You still on that run where you got bit in the neck? Uh, yeah, it wasn't a bite. It's a, what, a laceration? It's still bleeding, though, but... Trying to... I guess we can find out pretty quickly if we'll be fine. We can't smoke him, though, because we don't have anything, but... We can do... That. Come on. Come on. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. One more. Oh, damn. I really thought we had it. Okay. Go away. Perfect. That's what we need. Alright, we should be good. We would have... That would have shot way up. We would have been a nervous wreck by now. Oh, but zombie... Oh, nice! I'm glad you enjoyed it. Yeah, the community is awesome. Community is fantastic. So I'm impressed with how gigantic the map is. It's expanding, too. It's kind of weird that you need a lighter to make a fire. Not even an option to struggle with the stick rub. You can get a notched wooden plank to do the stick rub. But we need a plank for that, unfortunately. Yeah. Alright, we're going to restart because we're getting to the annoying songs. But uh, yeah, you, you can do that. We just, you need a, the correct items and we need a saw for that. We don't have a saw yet. We're just going to take the entire cooking pot with us. Don't need six yet. Dirty man doesn't matter. How are we doing? I want to remove the stitch. I think I'm going to leave it in for another day though. Just to be safe. Gonna open two things of food. Slap all of those in here. Okay. Melee weapon isn't really gonna do any good, but we can do. We can do axes, but I. Or, yeah, we still need a saw, so it's not gonna matter. I just want like two spears. Well, one on my back. And one on my hands. Okay. So, what I'm thinking, we're going to have to backtrack a ways. We go all the way back. So here's the farm. There's a warehouse and a bar over here. With the warehouse, we should be able to get a saw. I don't really care about the bar all that much. But we should be able to get into the warehouse and get a saw. And hopefully, I don't know if we really need a sledgehammer right now. But the saw is kind of the key. And then there's potential for a wooden axe or a fire axe. Should be nice. If we can't, we're just going to make our own axes and try to just start stacking wood. But that's kind of the plan for today. So, head off for the farm right now. Light is a match usually more common than saws. Yeah, but usually you're going to find them on... Oh, I guess we get there's a chance to find lighters in, in crates. But I feel like I'm finding the most of my matches and lighters on zombie corpses. And we haven't had that kind of luck yet. It's on the farm, like, right here. Yeah. Just push you over. Just push you over. Too far past the farm. Back down here. Just a sad reminder of what could have been. 
But we're using more builds and more builds plus and more builds appliances. So eventually we can always come back here and rebuild the farm. Which I think would be kind of fun to do. We are going to clear this area first. What do you have on you? taking you. I want to clear this area, though, because we're going to be coming back through here, and I don't want to be trying to walk through this while encumbered. lot of you. Jesus. Oh, this is not very durable, though. Yeah, because I'm not going to want to fight at the, uh, at the warehouse. Especially if we're on insane pop, there's no reason to even entertain that. This one should be dead here too. I mean, the storm sucks already, but I'd rather get these guys out of the way early. Also, we might as well be stacking kills for desensitized at this point. So, can get that out of the way early on. A crawler behind me, too. Alright, anything cool. If we don't get a single lighter from this, I'm going to be a little annoyed. sweatshirt though nothing oh that's annoying a watch that we don't need no lighter survive the day oh a few days yeah we're on day three right now you're basically unkillable. Oh, I've died a lot so far. I did I did do something really stupid though with combat and I didn't grab any uh any nimble traits. So that was me messing up pretty badly. I don't want that Ruger. Fall over. Fall over. Fall over. Fall over. All over. Jesus Christ. Thank you. Oh my God. Did not want to go down. 
Yeah, I don't, the Ruger sucks. It's like three shots. Not worth it. Oh my god, there's so many. Okay. We're gonna ball you all up. Come on. Come on. You're all coming this way. Come on. Come on. Do one more shout to really pull them over. And then we're going to dip out. We're going to loop right back down through here. Okay. There's not even a chance for us here. Main road. Hold on. We are... A little north of where I want to be. Can you explain how desensitized perk works? Yeah, so... I didn't get a chance to adjust it because you can't edit sandbox settings in uh, CDDA. So there is a minimum kills. I think this one is only 500. I usually set it to 2,500. And a maximum kills, which I think is 2,500. And I usually set it to 5,000. So what happens is once you hit 500 kills in this playthrough... You basically have a roll percentage chance every night at midnight to obtain the desensitized trait. Which is massive. Uh, after 2,500 kills, so that percentage chance increases each with each kill. At 2,500 kills here, we will just obtain the desensitized trait. So we have to kill 2,500 zombies. Uh, and that'll happen, I don't know if that's instant or again if that's at midnight. They definitely broke in behind me already, too. Okay. Sledgehammer. Don't think I saw... I mean, there was definitely a hammer there. But we're gonna need to keep looping them. Do one more shot back in. If nothing else, the club hammer is great for weapons. Play with mods for this run always. Yeah, the only time I'm not playing with mods is when we're doing world record attempts. After 1500? Oh, maybe it is 1500 then. Sorry, yeah, but normally, like when we run on, like on both of our servers, we run 2500 and 5000. Because oh, I feel like just 500 as a percentage chance just is, it's almost, it's a little too easy. Happen in multiplayer as well. Yeah, so both on my multiplayer servers, we run 2,500 kills as the minimum and 5,000 as the maximum. Just to, because multiplayer tends to be a little bit easier as well. I really wanted more weapons. Ooh, nails. Take those. It definitely just broke down behind us. Yep. Saw. Okay. That is everything we needed. I'm not going to overstay my welcome here. But, I mean, you know, let's do one more. Well, they're all stuck in there, actually, so never mind. But Anything in here? Baseball bat. <sighs> Not worth. No, too close now. Locked. Last chance here. Ooh, a lighter. Okay, we'll take that. Out. And the bar was so important for the cigarettes. And the the lighters in here. So we're going to do something dumb. I want to make sure there's an, ex there's an exit door back here. Because I don't remember. I think there is. Okay, there definitely is. It's locked. Okay. 
Oh, there's a second set of doors. Okay. Gonna come out. Awesome. They need to be far enough away that I can go hit both doors and see if they're gonna unlock. Otherwise, I think we can go this way. No, we can't. That's upstairs. Okay. Ah, uh, I'll die if I do that. Instead... Do that. Or we can hope they broke down the back door over here. They did. Okay, they did already. So, that escape would have killed me. Not worth. Let's just get out. We have a later. That's all we need for now. And then all we need are axes. But again, we can uh, craft a few of those. Let's get back into the woods here. Then I'll, I'll read chat once we get to... Uh, Get out of the, the infested sections. I'm still super bummed. Actually, you know what? While we have the time, we might as well loot this. So there are some pretty abusive things you can do with more builds, like those mods, because I have all I have more builds, more builds plus, and more builds appliances. Some pretty cheesy things you can do, like building wells and building generators. I'm not gonna do that, um, just because I feel like it's so it's a lot easier to do that kind of stuff than to just go find them. So for the sake of of keeping the video semi entertaining, we're just gonna go look for those things. So not look for a well, but you know what I'm talking about. your water in your backpack. Yeah, just because it's so heavy. There we go. And then we can immediately make three axes. I mean, we have the climbing axe. I don't want to. I want to use that though. Except the shotgun. Don't want to use it right now. keep those on me the plank we can immediately turn around and make into a nosh plank i just need to figure out what we need or drill plank and now we can light fires i don't know if we can smoke cigarettes with them that'd be pretty funny if we could but i don't think we can i kind of i'm gonna test this real quick if you can that's super busted okay I was like, there's no way you're just shoving a plank up against a cigarette and rubbing it and hoping it lights. Set the alarms off long before. Yeah. Exactly. Set up alarm, run to oven, light it up. Yeah, or Molotov, right? Get them inside the building, like like the house on fire. 
We still have food. Yeah. What are we looking like? See, that's... We gotta get that up. So, another, uh... Another run tomorrow into town. And then we'll be able to hopefully remove both of these. Check my neck one more time. Time to show really you some just tech. agitated though, so we'll be fine. Drop you in there. I would, I mean, if we can get a car and get back into Maldra. We're basically set. Could just go up to the stove and light it. Yeah, but it's a lot of work to continuously light a stove every time with a notched plank. You said it anywhere, but do you, what do you use to record your videos? OBS. OBS, but I have, I have separate audio tracks. I don't want to sleep yet, though. It's so early. All right. I'm going to run to the bathroom real quick, though. And I think it's supposed to rain, so I'm going to let my dog in. And uh, I'll be right back in, I don't know, two minutes, two, three minutes, if that's okay. So, hang tight.
All right, I'm back. Or a change in music because that's all I've been listening to is RuneScape music. So we're going back to this playlist. Alrighty. Um, there's not really much I want to do with what's left in today. I guess we can go ahead and grab a few of you. Okay, and perfect, we're gonna get tired. Are you eating something? Um, I had a Pop-Tart. I have fruit snacks up here, but I haven't uh, opened them yet. I eat like a child. My, my daughter eats way better than I do. Don't remember a single note of music. It's good. I mean, the soundtrack's good. It's just we listen to it every multiple times a day. You guys not know? Oh my god, yeah. Yeah, my daughter's gonna be one on uh, Saturday. Very exciting stuff. Oh, and we're still a little depressed. What's the neck looking like? Just still absolutely horrible. Okay, we're gonna... There we go! We're, we're not... Uh... Hey, we'll take that, you know? Let's do this. All right. Got fresh bandages on. Looking good. I'm gonna start grabbing some leather strips. All these. Those. I think we're doing, I think we got a pretty good start going, guys. We're basically taking care of all the Moodles. I think the big thing right now, though, is going to be getting our hunger up, because with Underweight, we have that 20% melee damage reduction. As soon as we can get rid of that, we will be, uh, we'll be sitting pretty good. I do eventually want to move too. I'm not gonna put a ton of effort into into staying here, just because it's very far away. Which it's kind of nice being out in the middle of nowhere, but also at the same time, kind of sucks. You playing full vanilla no mods? No, 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 no. The only time I'll run no mods is when we're doing like world record attempts. You start a party? Yep, yeah, we have this nice, uh, we rented out this pavilion. Time to show you some integrity. And, like, all of our families are coming and stuff. It'll be fun. I'm excited for it. Congratulations, thank you. Yeah, uh, it's, it's the best thing ever. Like, it is. Uh, and, like, I was talking about it with some of the YouTube members yesterday, but, like, being able to be a full-time, like, YouTuber, uh, is, is been the best case scenario because I, I know I mentioned it earlier on the stream, but like I used to do sock like sock work. Uh, if you don't know, being a sock analyst is very fun. I guess fun's a weird word. Uh, it's very stressful and very time consuming. So I was a, I was a lead sock analyst and I handled first shift off the East Coast. Time to show you some integrity. Um, I worked fully remote, so I'd be up at 4 a.m. And I would work 5 to 1, and then I would be on call 24-7. Uh, so, I basically just never got time. And, like, I could not go to, like... If, if we were like, oh, we're gonna... Like, if my wife is gonna bring my daughter to the zoo. 
and like why and just walk around with her until she went to bed i couldn't go with because if something happens i'm on call so i had to be back at my desk waiting uh so i couldn't do anything really and so now i'm, I'm a youtuber which is weird but i can uh i can just be like oh i'm not gonna work today and we're gonna go do stuff so I ba basically i get to hang out with my daughter all the time now instead of a few hours a day if I can repair and make new windows for what? I'm oh, sorry, I missed. I definitely missed that. It's right after mine. Was it the 14th? Yep. Oh, that's exciting. Well, happy early birthday. Having a son. Yeah, it, it, it's very stressful when you have a kid, but it's also like the coolest shit in the world. Ours was very colicky. She had stomach issues for uh, the first, I mean, what, July? August, September, four months, four or five months. She had, she got rid of them like halfway through uh, October. So for the first, the first four months, we basically didn't sleep. So she would sleep maybe two hours at a time, and uh, would go on these massive. I'm sorry, I'm not trying to scare you, but I, I want you to be aware because no one told me any of this. But uh, if they have stomach issues like reflex issues, which is what my daughter had. She, there were times, they tell you, like, they'll sleep 18, 20 hours a day. There were times where my daughter wouldn't sleep for over 30 hours at a time. Like, 30 plus, 3 zero plus of no sleep for a baby is fucking terrifying. Uh, it's, it's very difficult, but uh, gripe water was huge. That saved our lives. Um, so, yeah. If any of you are going to be new parents and uh, your kids have stomach issues, I was in that same boat. And it sucks. So I know what you're going through. But it does, it does, uh, they say like colicky babies, it'll just one day you snap your fingers and it's done. That's very true. It sounds very untrue and that they're lying to you so that you don't like send it off to the, fu to the fire station. But it is very true. Uh, we went up to, basically we didn't go camping. Like my sister and my brother-in-law had this, basically a summer home up by this place where once, you know, like autumn hits. Uh, it's very cool to go there, and they do, like, it's very, like, small town. And we brought her up there, and she, that was, like, that weekend, she wasn't colicky anymore, and it just stuck. It's great. Once they're potty trained, it's so much easier. You just have toddler-proof your house. That's where we're at, right, well, not, we're not at the potty training yet, but we're, to we're getting ready to toddler-proof. Because it's easy to baby-proof stuff. You just lift stuff up into the air. But once they can start grabbing shit, so she can walk if she's holding something. But she's very eager to walk and grab stuff. So a lot of times, like, we, we basically, every, like, our coffee, sorry, our coffee table can't have shit on that anymore. Like, anything that you would be like, oh, I'm just going to set this here for a moment, that, you can't do that anymore. I definitely needed that shovel still. I guess we don't even need to be looting zombies right now, aside from lighter some matches. Well, lose crap in the cabinets and lock them. Yeah, the cabinet locks were huge. Gate, like baby gates everywhere. Every hallway has a baby gate. Our stairs have multiple gates on them. Ah, uh, yes, the police zombie. Thank you. Good reminder. Is that over here? Yes, okay. And the bulletproof vest, too, will help. Good reminder. Thank you. Completely forgot about this. animals or is it just one gremlin uh we have two cats and uh, a french bulldog which arguably the french bulldog is is more destructive than the baby a hundred percent 
So we, what happened was, uh, we had money left over from delivery because our delivery went was our insurance covered way more of the delivery than we thought. So we had all this money left over, and this was when I was, I was still working full time when I'm doing YouTube on the side. And we went camping one weekend, uh, probably probably two months after she was born, two three months after she was born, and. Uh, uh, my my um, mother-in-law, my father-in-law watched watched our daughter for the weekend, and we went camping. <laughs> Me and my wife got super drunk, and then we're like, "We should get a dog, cause then, cause then she'll be able to grow up with the baby. It'll be great." Uh, and not thinking like, "How the fuck are you gonna, you know, manage no sleep, working essentially working two jobs, and also a, a puppy." Uh, but you know, hindsight's twenty twenty. In the moment, we were like, "This is the perfect idea," and then so so we got this French bulldog, uh, who has just proceeded to completely skull fuck our entire house. Survivor home? Did I miss one? That's a lot of zombies over here. I feel like we're we're kind of I'm just wasting time right now. I'm gonna do this window though. Oh no 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 no! Not happening. Yeah, bad idea. Let's just get the hell out of here. Nope. I will check this car though if it's got fuel in it. I don't know if I'm gonna have enough time now, but. Yep. Okay. We needed keys or learning how to hotwire. Put cool, my keys in my person. You have to get real clever. Uh, hold on, sorry. I'm missing chat, I know. Sorry. We're just gonna... I'm gonna start working through because if there's a chance that there's keys in that car, we're gonna be set. Oh, Crimson. Welcome to the $1 book. Thank you. Can we... The nightstick isn't ideal either, but also don't have a lot of weapons, so... This is gonna get me killed. We don't have the nimble skill to, uh... I actually, let's... This also might get me killed, and it's gonna be for nothing, so never mind. I was gonna funnel them through the window, jump out through the window, and then lock them so they're stuck right there. And just keep stepping. It's definitely 100% gonna get me killed, so I'm not gonna do that. Uh, no. There's matches in there. That's cool. But we need keys. Oh, no, 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 no. Let's go around. Okay. Hold on. Need to do some investigative mapping real quick. It's gas station. Directly to our north. More trailer parks. Dixie sucks. Good old fire method? Maybe. Sorry, I'm trying to figure out where... I mean, the rail yard's gonna have so many weapons. We could just go directly south, right? Maybe we'll do that. Time. It's only 11.30. Yeah, let's do that. There's parking lots there, too, so we can... Might have a chance for a car, but if nothing else, we're gonna come away with a ton of weapons. Hopefully a canteen. Just badge your toddler into doing stuff. Oh, dude. Yeah. I, yeah. You, are you, if trying to argue your way with a toddler is... is you're gonna go nowhere. Luckily, my wife is a... A therapist who has multiple degrees and multiple certifications and specializes with drug abuse and children. So, she'll, uh... 
I'm just gonna default to her however she wants to do it because uh she is by far the most qualified person in the household to to handle kids so I'm just gonna wait for her to tell me what to do also there's a gate and fencing I don't oh this is the Walter white cabin which conveniently enough that's our name Perfect. I uh, don't really care about that. Never gonna pass up a sauna screwdriver. Never gonna pass that up. Take all you. We don't need the gray. And what we are gonna do is fill back up the cooking pot. Time to show you some integrity. Drug abuse and children. Oh yeah, she crushes it. Math. Walter White is canon. Uh, n no, but this is it's like the meth trailer. Like there's, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's like a hazmat suit and stuff in here. That M19 is gonna be a lifesaver. Again, M77. Uh, no. I'll take the hazmat suit, though. That's kind of cool. We'll grab a mannequin. Arash, thanks for the... Uh, welcome to the $1 Club. I don't know why I thought you were donating, but thank you. I appreciate it. Welcome to the welcome to the team. I should have an RV in vanilla. Yeah, that'd be kind of cool. RV interior, though. Kind of does the job. Okay, it's the isolated forest house not the cabin we can probably sleep there tonight too if we come back up and drop stuff off i don't think i brought food with me did i no and they're definitely not gonna have food down here but oh well we can be a little hungry that's kind of got to be once the injuries are healed up though food has to be the next thing on the agenda This is where me and Big Red are based up on the member server. Should be a shit ton of zombies. I want to check and see if there's a car down here, though. No vehicles. Okay. Shit ton of zombies over here. But uh, if you can get around them, a lot of good items here. Rest to grab them. Blowtorch, just welders, masks. Material wise, I don't really care. I just want the weapons right now, though. We can always get a get a trailer in a car and come back and and uh, loot it up. For now, we want want tangible pain. items right now. Someone chasing? No. Couple in here though. Anything good in here? Probably not. Cigarettes. Yeah. These are the buildings we want to get into. Actually, not even these ones. Sorry. We want, like, the huts. And we're tired. Oh, no. We want these bad boys. The giant bunkers. Yeah, very easy way to die over here, but, uh, I don't know. Feels like we should probably do this. A lot of materials you can grab in here. But we're looking for these rooms. And of course, we're not going to find anything worth grabbing.
The lug wrench is actually important. But they're pretty common. Should be a few of you in here. These shelves are where we want to be looking. We already have sledgehammers. Don't need those right now. It's a bad spot. Don't need thread. Can make my own. It's gonna be too heavy. Multiple though. Ah, I was hoping for a welder mask. Doesn't look like we're gonna find one though. Grab you. Gas tank in there. side over here radishes even though it's not gonna give us much food no all right bummer None of these have stuff in them. Right. Those are empty. We're just gonna go back up here and uh, rest at that house for the night. Actually, real quick. It's an office building right here. Oh, it's dark in here. Never mind. This might kill me. Zombies right there. Yeah, this is going to kill me. Okay. It's not going to do it. There's uh, a bunch of desks in there where you can get, like, Cigarettes, lighters, chips, all that fun stuff. Just hoping I can sneak in there and grab a few. And hug the fence right here as well. Like that. Here's where it gets risky because I can't see it all. You guys definitely can't see. And we just gotta kinda hope there's no zombies in here. There's no mattress in there, is it? Damn. There's no food in here. I mean, rotten food in here, but... Yeah. Might just be fucked on the hunger. Railyard has been kind of a bust. I'm trying to think of how far down I need to go. Forage for food. Or I can go all the way. This is going to be a trek. Could go all the way down by the rusty rifle. Try 
cards is American. I am. That's so far, though. Um, and we don't have a car. Like, that's the big issue still. No car. And I don't just want to sit around the cabin. I guess we can go to Crossroads because there's a, a used car dealership there and a gas station. So let's... We'll swing back to the base. Oh, I was really hoping we had a chance here. Swing back to the base, drop stuff off, and then we'll uh, head out to Crossroads. Dig worms? No, we're not that desperate. We are going to need a food, like a, a food source soon, though. But again, if we have a car, easiest thing in the world. track here it's the best place to lose zombies forests trees i keep forgetting to we have cigarettes now i don't need to not smoke i can just do that um how are we doing wound wise good good there we go. I'm trying to think of what else I can get rid of here. I'll clean this all out later. I just want to get going though. Looks good to me. Food. Let's go ahead and do... Just gives me a piece of bread. Yeah. Let's do that. And then, in terms of crossroads, we are a little bit away from it still. But we can just walk there. TFT I'm dyslexic. Oh no. Like we're never once we get a, a blowtorch though, like we're never gonna have to worry about metal. But hold on. This looks like it might be drivable. It is. Please God, have a key. Of course not. Why would it? Why would it? We'd be two up on our luck. That's good shit. Congrats. You survived the hardest start. Mission complete. <laughs> well, thank you for the five dollars, Lo. Yeah, I, we, we got through the the start, right? Now it's just a normal Zawoid game on insane pop in the middle of winter. He was on the floor. Was it? If I go back there and it's not, and we just wasted an hour. Time to show you some integrity. Can we go this way? Thank you. Up right near it. This is just a crack in the ground, guys. You absolute boners.
Oh, ho, 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 ho. not gonna happen. We're just walking. Ah, oh, good. That's on the floor. No, that's a crack. Yeah. We are not getting good with the car spawns either. We're not getting any. Oh, two more down there, but that's a lot of zombies. Time to show you some integrity. Let's see. Come on. I'm gonna spend four hours grouping all these guys up. The motorcycle would be pretty cool too. With that survivor home, was there a survivor home though, or were, were you guys just fucking me? Choppers happened. I feel like the heli event already happened because we're six months in. Time to show you some integrity. They buy that car still. Pull this way. I mean, there's a ton of food in there. But I don't know if we're ever going to be able to actually get into there. There's a chance. Okay. No gas. The key is in there, though, so... Better than nothing. The motorcycle's a little... Nah. Yeah, we're not gonna have time. Aww, oh, please don't. Okay, we're good. We're just gonna drink soda until we stop feeling hunger. Crushing three soda cans. I don't know of a way we can do this. Yeah. It's not even worth fighting. Oh, okay. I take a walk to the neighborhood and see if we can get lucky. Couple spots cars can spawn down here. Yep. Maybe. Nope. Tragic. Put everything we need for a car right there. There's also another spot right here where one can spawn, but I don't think it's a. Oh, nope. Ah, this blows. Well, need gas. Oh, you know what? I don't have a water bottle with me. Damn. I was like, we could totally siphon some. Is that is that vehicle by the other trailer park? And they're all just hanging out outside of the building. Oh, this sucks. Okay. Can we get any sort of lucky? Like this. How bad is it in here? I might just be dead. I'm gonna cut myself again, but we have thread to deal with it, so. How bad was that? Okay. Way more than I thought we are gonna be. All right, let's just keep going to crossroads. See if we can find one on the way. Keep moving. 
illegally hiked into Canada. Oh my god. We're not even going to get here until tonight, and then we're going to be tired, and we're not going to want to fight anything. We'll take you. We'll take you. And you. And you have... Uh, I want that stop sign. It's a lot of zombies. Too many to deal with, but... Just want a car. That's all I want. Nothing. Just give me one that... I doesn't even need to run all the time. Just, he just needs to run some of the time. And I'll be happy. Can we actually... Hold on. Silly me expecting all of these to be unlocked. Oh, that's a lot of zombies. There. No, not gonna have enough time. He was in the ignition of the box, like this one right here, the black one. What's wrong with this then? Is there no fuel in it? Yeah, out of fuel and a dead battery. Take your key though. I have a little bit of time here. No key. Alright, on to the gas station, because worst case scenario, we can get a can of gas here. Best case, one of those vans has a key in it. Uh, there should be a back door. Is that it right here? It's a bathroom. Is there a back door? Yes. Okay. This is dumb. Don't do that. But we have one of these now, which means if for some reason none of these cars work. Okay, bad engine. Take a key. Lock the trunk. Last one's over here. Just gotta kinda hope. Nope, why Time would this one?
Nothing. Okay. Bummer. We can siphon. Oh, I really thought I had some right there. Okay. Don't need much. Time to show you some integrity. How bad was the battery bad on that one too? What about this one? What about these spiffo vans. Come on. Can I siphon any of these? This one's got to have fuel in it, right? No. No. Maybe you? Maybe you? How do none of these have fuel in them? But all the other ones we came across did. I'm shocked to this. I'm stupid. Okay. Don't need all of it. Just need a little bit. Yeah. That's all I needed. Time to show you some integrity. This is gonna be one of the more difficult parts. The battery was fucked on this van, wasn't it? That was a big issue. Yeah, the battery's fucked. I have a feeling most vehicles are gonna have fucked batteries. Just seems like something that's gonna happen. To show you some integrity. Especially six months in. But we have fuel, so if we have the truck... No, the truck didn't have a key, but it had fuel. We're just... We can't get one that... Okay. It may just be better to work on hot wiring. Honestly. But I'm gonna need a vehicle to get a generator out of Muldra. Yeah, there's no way we're getting a car out of this. Close to water and gas station. Hold on, what? The best base for new players is probably Riverside Fishing Supply Shop? Yeah, probably. Which vehicle was it down? It was one of these. So this one just doesn't have gas, right? Yeah, oh, the, the fucking engine and the battery suck too. Okay, let's just, uh, pause. Might just cut my losses and head home here.
want you guys to know I'm going entirely off of sound cues right now. I cannot see. I can see about as well as you can see right now. Everything I'm doing right now is based off a of sound cue. And I'm definitely leading zombies right back to our location. Go to Dixie. There's a car there, a working car. Where? We we spent we just spent a ton of time in Dixie. Right? Have a good one, Danny. Right, like, there's nothing in Dixie that we can, that's usable, that we can get to. This is where Burglar probably would have been better than, uh, Repairman. Tisk, tisk, tisk. Dixie, there are two survivor homes. Okay. That doesn't help with the vehicle situation, though. to see where else we can go. Like, cause with, we're not gonna be able to get into Muldra and get what we need and get out without a vehicle right now. Trying to think of where I can go right off the jump here. So the main road is off limits. There's no way we do anything on the main road. We can go to the... It's a very long walk. But we can do the... Okay. We're going to go to the south end of Muldra. It's a very long walk. But probably... Best place we can go for... A few looting runs that we also have escapes from. All right, because there's fencing we can hop over if needed. We can bait around. Most of the buildings have two stories, so we can always jump out of the second story. The issue is it's going to take like four hours just to walk over there. And we have no idea how how busy it is. We kind of, oh, nice. Well, hello. Welcome to Zombo. the rail yard or not the rail yard it's one of the train stations but there's nothing useful there for us so also we're not gonna be good melee wise right now due to the uh even the left forearm it's gonna cause issues
just follow this for a long time here. Wait for the train track to bend south. Well, southeast. And then we go left. This is west. We need to keep going this way. We're by the what is this um trailer park right now? Gauge one, I can jump. Actually, we don't even need to jump. We just go until it ends. Once the fence ends, we can go over or go around it. There we go. Just go this way now. There's gonna be a few of them to take out here. This shouldn't be too bad. Let's see what we're doing damage wise. Ah, uh, horrible. Again, just need to keep them spaced out because we can't backpedal. Keep beta blockers on me, I did. Okay. I want to keep them over here too, so I, so I don't want the noise to travel. Start pulling over bigger groups. I want to stay with small groups for now. Lighters, matches, so it doesn't really matter. Okay. Nothing. I'm going to keep the watches because we can do electrical. Zombies in here. Foster for the weight. need food in general right now.
A belt is what we need right now, though. Has he died again? No. Nope. We've been... We're good. We're almost a week in. We're on day seven right now. Which room are you in? We might be able to hold up in one of these houses. At least for a, a short-term trip. Just want to eat that right now. Houses here. You guys want to see a really cool trick you can do for zombies like this? Is use the hedges. So, you can kite them into the hedge like this, and then you can walk out of it, and they get stuck in it like that. And they'll get stuck walking directly into it. And you can sit just outside. I just hit a tree. Can just form a line, people. There we go. There are a lot of you coming in. Shocking on you. We have... We might be... Well, probably not. We need a car. Or like a siren. So we can go... If we want to go loot the police station, we can do that. But even then, it's not really going to clear the area for us. There's too many zombies right now. like two more of these guys to go down before it's uh, a wrap. Thanks for all the zomboid tips really helped me improve my game. Is there a mod where I can pick starting weapon like Katana? Oh, well, thank you for the donation. Um, where you can choose your starting weapon. They're using, like, the more traits mod, you can start, like, there's, like, prepared bundles, so you can start with, like, a bundle, like a backpack and stuff. Otherwise, if you go into sandbox, I believe you can start with an item. Like, you can put the code in for it, the item ID. So what you can do is, uh, like, spawn items. I can tell you exactly what it's called. And it'll be, like, you would put, I'll type it. It would be, like, base dot, I don't know, something like that. And you, uh, you can start with that item. The best way, if you're looking for the item name, the best way to do this is to go into a hosted session and give yourself admin access, and then right-click an item and select edit. It'll tell you, like, every item will be base dot the name. So if you wanted to give yourself a katana, you can do base dot katana. 
It should be like in the spawn items category. I'm not sure where in the sandbox settings. It would be towards the top. So mod lets you choose an entire letter. Oh, that's sick. So find awesome. Yeah, let me yeah. See if you can find it, I can pin it. It might not let you send the link, so if you can give me the name, I can post the link to it. I think I have links blocked or like moder moderated on YouTube because uh all the bots will use them and spam like porn links and shit. We don't need that. Higher bag of marshmallows. What kind of knife do you have? Oh, it's a red knife. Another cooking pot with water. There we go. Never gonna have to worry about water again. We're just gonna eat all this. Where are you stuck in? find a watch well thank you Ooh, we need this then i'm sure it is big extra layer of clothing because it is gonna get colder a deagle yeah we'll take that for now eventually firearms are gonna be awesome time to show you some integrity Start collecting recipe mags too now. John B is sus. What I miss? It's like, oh Jesus Christ! Broken windows lose heat. That would be pretty nice. Sixty pop world will I have enough time to do a full playthrough. Well, how long is a full playthrough? I don't think Build 42 is coming out until November, or December. Don't the chills. Yeah, agreed. Is in the chat distract you? Yeah, I try not to read it while I'm like I've died a lot in multiplayer stuff from just reading chat while walking or driving. So I try not to read it until I'm looting. Uh, when I was doing the world record attempt runs, I would stop. I would do like a few minutes. At the start of every day and a few minutes at the end of every day. Like right now, I'm not going to read chat. Well, sometimes I do. Because I'm an idiot. But most of the time. Most of the time, I'll wait till I'm done. Just want more lighters and matches. I don't see why it's just so hard to uh, to find those things. Oh, 
Oh no, our hammer. I think I am gonna base up here for the night though. We'll just pick one of these houses, but we still have a little bit of time to go. One of you wants the club hammer. Probably, I'll probably stay tech. in this house. Kill a couple of you before. No. Actually, this is gonna work perfectly. Come on. More zombies in that house. Yep. Just broke a window. Oh, and we're exerted. Um, we'll go stay here then for the night. This hammer's gonna break soon too. myself okay and then do this yes really hard to see here It's late. Let's go crash here. Are we looking like hunger wise good? I'm like sleeping next to dead bodies. Should be okay. Yep. I'm gonna save these so I didn't read. Electrical one yet. Oh, you know what? Real quick. I'm going to go hunt for a book or two. Don't know if I'll find one, but... No. Your chocolate, at least. Soda's gonna do unhappiness. So let's do this. Alright. We'll sleep, and if I'm still a tad weepy, cigarette in the morning will help. And, uh, should be able to Time do this. Time to show in. you some integrity. Charge your best in this accounts. What happened? Are you role playing something? No. start with. Oh, good one, Raving. So it'll give you more unhappiness if you pour it in the cup first? Oh, maybe. I don't know. I always just chug the, chug the cans. What are we at? Still 73 and gaining. We'll smoke, and then we'll eat the chocolate in a little bit, and that should hopefully get us over the hump. 
Oh look, they just waited outside. So polite of them. Might as well move these weapons over now, because we're going to be using them. I want to check out that jeep later too. Zigzag you and do this. Time to show you some integrity. Did not work at all how I was hoping it would. Okay. It's still very dark out too for some reason. Level was maintenance three, sprinting two, short blunt's gonna be three. Ooh, <laughs> what are the fucking odds? What are the odds? That's gonna be one of the luckiest grabs. Just randomly going through mailboxes. What are the odds? That's so nice. Okay. If nothing else, this was a win. And then we're about to get this pretty substantial combat boost right here. More hit. There we go. I don't want to go too far because there's more zombies over there. Still got a lot to work through here too. get some stuck in the fence right there. Okay, awesome. That's exactly what I was hoping to happen. That beta blockers just do nothing. They do absolutely nothing. The sooner we get to 500 kills, the better off we're going to be. The shotgun sucks, so we're not going to touch it. Take your watch. I'd like to be able to get us into a position where once we go loot a bookstore, we can just sit down for a week and read books. You break doors with a crowbar. Uh, you grab the, grab the common sense mod. You can pry open doors with crowbars. Hold on. One of you had something. Oh, it's a pencil. 
Got excited. Let's get your watch. Take your watch. It's mechanics two, electrical one, right? That's what we need. I always forget with hot wiring. Battery's dead too, so we need a battery charger. Mechanics tool. Let's go one. Okay. How's it going, Onion? Good to see you, man. This is actually a gold mine for us. We'll get in here. Come on. Okay. Wrong window. But... Come on. Sometimes you get lucky and there's guns in here. Not in this one, though. It's those armoires in the bedrooms. Shop one and hopefully find some nails or anything. Ooh. Where's the run going? Um, we died like, I think, five or six times right at the start, but then this run's been going. I mean, we're on day seven. So. Finally got our footing. see how close we are to leveling up nimble i can't imagine it's very far but very excited to boost that uh awesome all right so this house now oh we can get rid of depression though real quick Chocolate didn't do that? Are you kidding me? Getting out of there. Time to show you some integrity. I think tomorrow, so we'll finish looting some houses here today and kind of clearing out the area. Tomorrow, we'll head up to the bookstore and see if we can find anything cool. And then, uh, actually, we're pretty close to the, the warehouses by Rusty Rifle. So maybe we'll just go there instead. It's only, actually, it's only 9 a.m. Let's go do that right now. I don't know why we're waiting. We're going to set this as kind of our designated safe house for now. How much space we have in here? 39. All this is just going in here for now. think we're good. Don't need an extra backpack for now either. 
Uh, you can go in here. We don't need another water bottle. Back to we don't need. All right, let's go party. Go in warehouses, grab more weapons, tools. There's also a chance we can get a sledge because I didn't bring my sledge with us. Oops. I also need to keep checking these cars. That's good shit. I love smelling okay. toilet seats. Yikes. <laughs> anyway. Got a skeletal. Yeah, have a good woman. And a generator. There we go. Can I? No, there's no way I can throw this in a backpack. Can pull you guys over here, though. That's a huge win. Because I was gonna go look for a sledgehammer to break into the self-storage to get to that, but instead, we don't need to now. Because you a pretty demanding game in terms of uh, like resources. Not necessarily. I would say if you're going to get it, but you're worried about like if you can run it well, turn off blood physic like blood right now. So perform I guess it's worth noting. Build 42 performance is getting substantially better. So if you're really wor worried about it and you really don't think you can, I would wait. Uh, uh, allegedly, Build 42 is going to address a lot of like issues. He's got a katana in him. Um, otherwise, turn up blood splatter. That's the largest cause of, uh, like, that right there. Largest cause of uh, performance issues is blood. I really want that katana. I want that katana, but it's gonna be stupid because I'm just not gonna use it until my maintenance gets way higher. Hoping that gets rid of that. Take you. Shit. All right, Katana just may not be in the stars. I don't know how many weapons we have left. Do you have dynamic traits on? No, I'm not running more traits. The closest thing I have to that on is uh, um, become desensitized, which will remove my panic traits once I obtain the desensitized trait. So. Yeah, beta blockers aren't doing anything for me right now, unfortunately. They're borderline not worth using. I'll take like six of them. Way here.
Let's see if I can just keep... Well, actually, we can, we're slowly whittling through them. And I just need to take, like, seven things of beta blockers. In order to, uh, lose panic. Ah! Clicked off screen. Chip stones. Favorite QL mode. I I love it. Yeah, the the only issue we were, like I was telling people earlier with this one, there's no way for us to edit it. But by default, I keep it 2,500 and 5,000. Uh, this for this set for like the CDDA playthrough, it is 515. Whatever the default is, uh, because we're we're unable to change it. Collecting garbage bags is what I need to be doing. Okay. Uh, Katana Boy. Where, where where the hell did he go? Did I miss him? Or is he just stuck? Yeah, okay. They all just gave up over here. Or did he despawn? Like, he's not in this group. Time to show you some integrity. Time to show you some. There he is. Crawling towards the finish line. Walked over his body by the jeep. Okay. Perfect. Let's clear these guys out then. How many do we have left? Where we at hunger was still going up. I was really hoping it could knock him over. 
This is not going to be enough time. here yeah back here too He was all the way back here. Hype. There we go. Grab all those. Sweet. All right, let's rest real quick. Take you. Toss you back. Nearly perfect condition, yeah, but I don't have a key for it. The battery is dead. Like, I need a battery charger and to learn how to hotwire before we really get moving here. All right. The goal is going to be just cut through here. Gonna be a lot of zombies here. And hopefully, I'll be able to do this without having to fight any of them. Oh, I am just fucked. Oh, there we go. Okay. I was like, I just can't move. I'm just stuck in the car. That was almost really bad. Just more like right in front of me. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Big piles. We're not going to be able to do anything with these guys. Except, like, pull them out of the area, maybe? When you come up to change your quarry, I'm getting, like, super hot. I feel like it makes more sense. Oh. <laughs> Katana, but also, yeah. Yeah, fair. fair. Really good Katana. Wish the Jeep was drivable, though. See how much we can get away with here. Does not sound like much. Wow, that was depressing. They're all going to be in these trees, too. Yep. How bad is the road going to be right here? Okay. Oh, there is just a ton of them. There's an axe in there, though. Time to show you some integrity. Car 
far as the intersection yet. Yeah, we went all the way down to Crossroads. We didn't go to the south one, though, over here. Just this side. Um, that is so many zombies. We're not going to be able to, like, really do anything over here. i loop back through here real quick. We'll continue to kind of pull them away. But if we're hoping to go loot that, it's going to take a considerable amount of time to, to work through everything. Hopefully we can get back to the uh, the houses pretty quickly here. Also, just sleep here. I think I'm going to do that. It's really a little sad. What the room's looking like. too crazy oh. books you got first aid volume one hell yeah think first aid does anything it does first aid helps with with healing speed speed and you're able to diagnose injuries so your bandages are more effective they stay effective for longer is the big one it's in the toolbox nothing oh, i was really hoping that would do it on the bright side though we lost underweight, so we have that 20% damage boost. We keep going. Read for another hour. Okay. Garbage bags. Oh, you know what? Let's refill our water, too. Hold on. No. Nope. All the batteries are going to be completely shot. String bleach. Yeah. Nice. Let's get out of here. Use cigarette butts for anything? Yeah. So you can still smoke them. You can also dismantle them and get uh, tobacco and butts and then basically like hand roll your own. Give me like, no, nothing. Okay. A lot of zombies down here. Oh, even more. Jesus. All right, let's go this way. So, 
There isn't really much of a way to do this without just brute forcing our way in. The issue with brute forcing your way in is it requires a lot of weapons. We have, well, I guess we have a katana, but in terms of like short blunt, we have two. We're gonna need more than two. We also don't have anywhere to rest. So we just gotta kind of hope. Nope. I'm not gonna do that. Sweeper say it also impacts your swing speed too and your movement speed so if you have like glass in your feet which you have first aid level 10 if you if a person with first aid level 10 stitches your glassed up feet you'll move you only have like an 80 percent movement speed instead of like a 20 percent so it negates more of that debuff just a big piece I think there was yeah there's a police station up there but how are we we can't have no way to get into the weapon lockers right now this is too big of a group to fight right now okay teak oven there was a hammer back there we don't have enough time yeah yeah that sucks it's a bad loop but Maybe we got lucky here. Definitely didn't. Pull you guys down this way. My hat. I'm basing up there. I have, well, the base locations aren't the problem. I just need to get gear. And like a lot of these weapons, like this is what McCoy's gonna look like too. Should be able to get that. What are the settings? It's the six month later preset. So start in the middle of winter. Insane pop zombies. Powers off, waters off. And then the a release CDDA challenge. So, start with glass shards in your groin, so you can't run or walk. You have to limp everywhere. Uh, it's a deep wound, so you need needle and thread to heal it. Uh, again, middle of winter, you start blackout drunk and with a nasty cold and soaking wet. Basically, if you fell out of the shower into a glass window. And then insane pop zombies. Can I get out through here? Yeah. And also, whoever recommended the police station, that is a, it's a, it's a very bad idea. Very bad idea. So we have aiming zero, which means we have to rely on shotguns to do anything. Also, it's insane pop zombies. So anywhere that we shoot is going to pull a 150 tile radius. Oh, also the house is on fire too. Yeah, the house is on fire. So there's no way for you to exit the house without getting burned. The best we can do here is turn on one of these sirens and dip out. I'm 
and then hope that clears the area enough. the hat off. Just loop. There we go. Who's been locked? Battery's dead. Battery's gonna be dead in that one, too. Um. Alright. Gonna stop walking through the trees. Siren. Yeah, exactly. Battery's dead. Sirens won't work. So. We're once again kind of back in this to show you some situation here. It's fine. Yeah. Well, I guess someone, yeah, I saw someone recommended Dick going back to get the survivor homes in Dixie. It's kind of our, our best option right now. So we can do that. I'm gonna leave the generator at the house for now, though. Just because we don't really have a need for it right now. And all it's gonna do is weigh me down. And likely end up getting me killed. Yeah, noisemakers wouldn't be the worst thing in the world. It's definitely another way we can go with it. We also do have the route as well of going with a, uh, like, a, I mean, we need a welder's mask still and a propane torch. We have propane everywhere. We could go metalworking and build a metalworking bench and start building, like, scrap swords and stuff. Like, that's always a route we can take. I don't think we looted this area yet. And we do have a decent amount of weapons still, too. It's not like we're running out. We just don't have much on us. Kind of been burning through them since we've been here. It's halfway gone. Uh, nah. Where are we at kill-wise right now? 247. Halfway there. Halfway there to start rolling. the katana i did and we just got a heli event
Which means, uh, it's time to get the fuck out of here. Time to show you some integrity. Get a long walk back now. But luckily we're in the middle of nowhere, so it's not really going to impact us. You can just completely skip the hell event. Correct. Let me double check here. We can just kind of follow the train tracks. Almost all the way back. What we can also do is we can move. It'll take some time, but we can basically move to that. Uh, there's a, a cabin similar to what we're in now that's just to the east, like southeast of Maldra. So we can always move there. Though it's, it'll take a, a, a trip or two, but I'd much rather just get a car, honestly. Or we can move to the abandoned warehouses by... Uh, just just under the rail yard to go there but then you risk uh pulling zombies with your generator so i don't know Gonna trek back though. Oh, we're actually pretty close. Done. Ah, uh, well, food we can dump here. Don't need any of that. Actually, we'll grab chips. Everything else for now is just gonna get tossed. Okay. Let's 
go ahead and sleep. We'll read magazines right away in the morning and the books until sunrise and then we'll go back to Dixie. out all right let's head back in I'm gonna see the a cataclysm dark days ahead but the challenge is a homage to that not exactly CDDA. Rick, how are you doing? Good, sir. Good to see you. It is afternoon. It's like 2.30 for me. It's gross. No more world record types. We'll, be, we'll revisit them. I wanted to do some other stuff. Between, but I wanted to get back into uh, weekly streams again, and this was an easy way to do it. I was like, oh, why don't we just do something I've never done before? Oh, we did not eat at all. Uh-oh. Completely forgot about that. Did I dump all my beta blockers too? No. Okay, there's one. Oh, no, I left a hammer. Okay. Let's go find food real quick. There's the second one, right? They're going to loop around here. Not enough, but it's okay. So as straight mods goes, I'm surprised no one thought of a fear of darkness trait yet. Um, yeah, that'd be, I feel like there is. I feel like there's got to be something like that by now, even if just a standalone mod. Unless people figured like agoraphobic fell into that category of just being outside at all, cause panic. Thanks. How are you finding the hardest start? <laughs> I difficult at first, but again, once you kind of get your footing, you once you get past the start, it's good. But we, I, I had probably five or six starts in a row where fire was in every single room, so I just couldn't leave. So it's like, okay, I'm just, I'm just gonna hope I don't burn to death before I exit the building. But after that, it's been good. Yeah, whatever. We're like, what? Nine days in? Doing okay? I'm starting to wish I would have brought the katana. Or at least just another weapon. This is not going to last much longer here. Come on, get stuck in all these trees over here. I 
Did we manage to get any of them stuck on that survivor house over here? No. Oh, wait, maybe. Hold on. Okay, awesome. We definitely did. How fast can I do this? Not fast enough. I was really hoping we had enough time there. Even just that 2x4. Because this is going to break in a few more hits. Just going to take his sweet fucking time to get over there. We're going to head back and grab more weapons. It's only 9 a.m. We got time. Panic. That was the easiest start going. Incredibly easy. Haven't died at all. Totally don't check the beginning of the stream. I'm gonna bring this just because we need it. But otherwise. I'm gonna bring you. I'll bring two hammers. And I'm gonna be an asshole. And we're gonna bring a shotgun. This is going to end horribly. Actually, they all forgot about me. Hold on. They definitely did not forget about me. But... Avoid the shotgun for now. It's a singular 2x4. Barunga, thank you for the 10 months. Good to see you. It's gotta be late as shit by you. What are you doing? Go to bed. Time to show All right. you some integrity. We're doing it. survivor right there with a, with a knife and a spear on him. Is that a welder mask? No. Okay, my goal is hopefully I can just continue to group them. Not late here yet. Nice. My goal is I can pull them all together and then just kind of guide them off to the east, circle around south back through. Come on. Another survivor right there. to slowly continue to pull them this way. If these survivor houses suck, I'm going to be so annoyed. I feel like they are because they're going to be trailers. Time to show you some integrity. Time to show you some integrity. Just do this. If we only have a couple chasing us back, I'm totally. There they go. They're just gonna keep wandering back over there. It's 
frustrating. If we can get a car, we can kind of jumpstart everything because I know exactly where I'm going to that same military surplus store I hit up in that in the episode one of They Know, like where you are, that new series. I'm going to that same military surplus store. And I'm gonna grab the same same guns I did that. And then I'm just gonna come back here and we're just gonna slowly work our way into a warehouse. It's just not working at all how I was hoping it would. Actually, it kinda of did. It kinda of did its job a little bit. Hold this way. And go down here. And this, I think that's the issue is like we spent a good two days looking for cars and we can either find cars that have no keys or cars that have a key but their battery is dead. Or cars that have a good battery and have gas or we can give them gas. But, their engine's fucked. We just can't win. I want that axe, though. Single file, please. There we go. Stuck right there. Oh, I need to stop to do that. Okay. Neat cleaver. We want that. Eventually, they're all just going to start dropping, and I can't wait. And until then, we're going to become moderately exerted. Anytime now. Okay. This one was right up here. Oh my god. Just keep coming and they don't stop coming. They don't stop coming. And they don't stop coming. They don't stop coming. They don't stop coming. They don't stop coming. And then they hit the ground running. This is a very bad idea. Yep. Soon as the push came. Okay. Let's rest real quick, and then we'll finish them off, head back in. Crowbar is long blunt. Crowbar is not sharp one. Actually, wait, no. Can you hold the crowbar with one hand? I feel like that might be... I don't know. Crowbar both hands. Anything you can 
anything you hold with both hands, I thought, is long blunt. Except with the exception of, like, a nightstick, but I don't know if that's modded or not. Wait, we want to stay in this area. Come on. We need to go away from the van for a little bit. I have a faction, so I don't need to wake up at midnight to loot. <laughs> Facts. I thought we had a faction and, and the public server would be... We had one that was, like, in Australia. It was just only Australians. Never gonna... Yeah, not gonna have enough time. Yeah. All right, well, we'll lead them back for the night. It's fine. Unless I can burn it real quick, but even then I'm already tired and I don't think I brought vitamins with me. Did not, okay. We'll come back in the morning. I mean, at least both of the, both of the survivor houses have entrances into them now. So there's nothing we need to disassemble. But, uh, damn, it sucks. Okay, pause. Cannot fucking stand the song. Can we remove it? Can we remove it from the... This is the song every single time it's on. I talk about how much I hate it. And I never remove it. I don't even know where it is. I can't stand it though. All right, the shotgun kinda served its purpose. I don't need it anymore though, so we're good. Keys don't need. Need cleaver don't need. Don't need. Don't need. Don't need. Don't need. Don't need. Oh, you know what? It's way too early to go to bed. Selfish Machete and Selfish Crowbar are amazing for scrap weapons. Hell yeah. Put them on the belt. Makes them so much better. I agree. We were on the same page. Nightstick. Banned. Yeah. Yeah, it is. It is, but... But... Ball-peen hammers are so much more satisfying. We use... No, we didn't. Right? No. Okay. Uh, okay. Let's... Let me make sure I have, like, actual shit to bring with me this time. How much water do we have left? Go party. Club hammers are underrated, I agree. Club hammers and ball peen hammers are my favorite melee weapons. Actually, I've been getting really into short blades recently. Any suggestions on which one? Hold off on it, and I can get you a pretty significant discount sometime in the nearest future. Wait a month. Wait a month and I'll have an answer. It's all I can say right now. Uh, I'm, I'm not we're not doing anything until I uh, until we wipe the PZ servers again 
because we just wiped. I don't want to try to do anything crazy in the middle of a wipe. That is going to be perfect timing. Look at that. I'm about to hit short blade five, four as well. I do want to move them away from the vehicle though, because I've been using that to rest. I feel like we're going to have problems. Crowbar on him now. Ooh, hold on. Is it just a hockey stick? In them too. There's a ton of loot in these zombies. Time to show you some integrity. We just gotta get them into like small, like just tiny groups. If we can split them up into like three or four different groups, this will be so much faster. And we're gonna spend all morning working through this group to even get to one of the survivor houses, and I guarantee you, all that's gonna be in is just that fucking two by four. You gonna make a video out of this? Probably not, because I'm on Streamlabs, so my audio is all uh, jumbled together. So I can't, I can't make a video on it without the music being all wonky. Because if we sped this up, the music's gonna speed up. But if I do it on OBS, uh, we can split everything into different audio streams, so we can take this music out entirely. Honestly, though, there isn't really all that much that needs to get done with this to complete, like, the the challenge was to basically survive CDDA. We're in a position where we can survive pretty well, honestly. We're already halfway through December. So, I'll probably do, I'll probably do, like, one or two more weeks of this. And then I think maybe, maybe in August we'll get back into a world, another world record run. We'll see, though, because world records are, f they're refreshing, but holy shit do they suck when uh, you can't use mods. Look at all of you. We just stealth walk around them here. Maybe. If they're actually going to do that, though, we can just skip them. World record. There's uh, kill counts, like vanilla, like pure vanilla runs. 16 pop ones. Isn't it this one? They destroyed all of the shit. Oh, no. I went past it. Oh, I'm so stupid. Oh, what did I do? Are they in here still? Yeah, they are. Alright, I guess we're just gonna have to 
work through Dixie. I'm serious, if these survivor homes sucks and we just waste all of our time, I'm just gonna kill this character. And we'll move on to another challenge. I just spent like a week in game trying to clear out Dixie. The worst place anyone would ever want to live. Time to show you some integrity. Survivor zombies are more profitable than Survivor homes, honestly. Uh, yes and no. It depends on the home. You can have one like my cryogenic winter start where I walked into two Survivor homes. And they were, uh, full of scrap weapons and shit. So I had, like, machetes, scrap pickaxes, some crazy weapons. So it kind of just depends on luck of the draw. And how many lootable containers are in the building. So, for example, these are tra like these trailer homes. They probably have like five or six lootable weapons, like lootable containers that they can put weapons into, versus like a mansion, which can have fifty. I need to pull these guys away so I can rest right there, though. Oh wait, hold on. I have a plan here. All of you are coming this way. It's just you. Fall over. Fall over. Fall over. Come on. Such a waste of time. We're just going to keep pinballing back. Frank and John. There. We'll just pinball back and forth. I just want to rest. Did we do it? Awesome. No, because that one's walking right over. Get the hell away from me. Don't worry, we're just all going to get corpse sickness now. Out of water? No, here. Boom. Alright. Now we can go party. This 
hammer's gonna break soon. Bingo. We need you. That was not at all what I was hoping for, but okay. Okay. Pick the sludge. It's two sledgehammers. Colt Python. Take that. Not bad. Not bad. Not the best haul, but Colt Python will be nice. Is there anything in the bedroom at all? A word search. Okay. Can't even get to that. Can we just disassemble the bed? A wood axe. Okay. Worth it. 100% worth it. That was the first one, though, right? We got one more. Don't want to don't damage that hammer. Get you back in the primary. mark things in your inventory so you can transfer it like that uh i hold down control and left click otherwise you can do shift too oh sorry let's go ahead oh that's a big group what was the other one like way up here or was this the other one right here am i just stupid also, it got incredibly dark for no reason. Oh no, the other one is way over here. Um, let's do some Moodle management. This is going to be better if I just bait them. Where we at kill wise? 315. I don't think I can fight these guys, but I want that axe.
This is the one with just the plank in it. Let's see. Let's see what we can do. I know there's more in there too, which sucks. Hunter's mask. This one? Yeah. Headhunter gas mask. We have the rest of their outfit at the uh, in the cabin still, too. Just don't want to use it right now, because this is uh, more insulation. Should be able to let's see where those chairs like right down here. Yeah. So other than animals, I think it'd be a great addition. Animals will be cool. Again, I think the crafting overhaul is more underrated than the animals. I think the animals are getting all the hype, but the crafting overhaul is gonna be absolutely insane. I'm very excited for that. You're, people will use the crafting overhaul more than they breed animals. In my opinion. It's so complicated. Yeah, it's it's it you know what it is though, they're crafting, it's it's like ten years of adding new things without sitting down and just going, Okay, let's actually build a crafting system. It's it's all like their crafting right now is okay, but it's all stuff that they've just been slowly adding over time. So they're like, oh, this would probably be cool. Let's do this. Let's add this, and then now they can sit down and go, let's actually build an, a legitimate crafting found. Like, there's no foundation to build from. It's just these items do this. These items do this. Have fun. And now with the foraging rework, it makes sense to revisit crafting. And they're so inclined to redo fishing, and I really, really hope that they uh, do something like Stardew Valley's fishing system. But it does suck because it was always. I do really enjoy the current fishing system because I can just AFK on a multiplayer server and like step out and be like, all right, I know I can still get shit done if I just step away for a little bit. No, nah, we're gonna lose that, unfortunately. Time to show you some integrity. This axe has been really good so far. Surprisingly.
This is all to get to a potential second survivor home. I'm gonna do that same loop again right here. Get all of them in here. Just hop right back out. I think I would like to do a playthrough where I, I where I level axe for a while because I I usually avoid them because I use them as tools all the time, so I always get like super anxious about using them as weapons. And I think I would like to actually do weapons once. That'd be a lot of fun. That was a waste of time. We're gonna get stuck in this blizzard and end up dying from it. Oh, it's already like 8 o'clock. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, you guys just gotta get out of here. Joey, welcome to the Dr. Pepper group. Thanks for becoming a member. Far away we- Oh, we overshot it. It's up here. This is gonna be... One of those times where we hide from the storm for a little bit. Pepper. Ah, no. Dr. Pepper's where it's at. What time is it? 310? This is for, uh, Forever Winter? No, it's just the CDDA challenge. Time to show you some integrity. You ever tried Dr. Pepper Strawberry? Yeah, it's, it's one of those drinks that probably goes really well with, like, booze or, like, in a shake or something. I don't know. It, I don't like it by itself. I feel like that's something you gotta mix. Still a bad blizzard out. How bad is it, like, really? Oh, not... Or, I mean, 14 degrees, but... Could be worse, I guess. I pour this into the water bottle. Oh, and I'm still going to have some left. Awesome. Can dump all that for now. Uh, Weapon-wise, we... Oh, yeah, we're more than fine. Okay. We'll do one more run. If we don't get it, we don't get it. Oh, I just completely missed him. There we go. Okay, not really sure how I want to do this, but we only have the, we only have that last house left, so I can't imagine this will be over the top. 
We'll probably just continue to, to go through one at a time here. Time to show you some tech. Here we go. I'm surprised this, the climbing axe has held up the way it has though, because we've killed probably 20 or 30 zombies with it. Including like the very beginning. We've had it for a while. We are getting like no XP for this stuff. 0 0.3, 0 0.3. Let's see. Just slowly chip away at him here. This is that last big group in the area. Gonna pull them down here. Let's go here. Can we kind of sneak our way in? No, not really. I like the tire iron axe a little bit more. This, this doesn't feel like it does any damage. The fire axe. So the, the two big zombies I want are in here. I'm gonna see if I can do this. I don't think I can do this quickly enough, but. There's just food in here. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe in the other rooms? Yeah, nothing in here. Oh, waste of time. Right. Oh, actually, I do want to come back here and, uh... Oh. They gotta get worked through because I want the zombie with the crowbar on his back and I want the zombie with the axe stuck in its back. I'm not gonna tell them to stop fucking cheesing my plate. <laughs> How's it going, Oil? Good to see ya. Say when? 
Sir? Sir? Please? Sir? Sir? Voice sounds higher and live. What's the deal? Ah, different mics. I use an XLR mic for voiceovers. I use a quadcast uh, for streams and multiplayer. So that may be why. Also, I've been sick recently. So when I was recording these last few videos, I've been sick. So maybe that? I don't know. You guys just don't want to die. All right, I'm gonna head back because that was just not really worth it. I think my plan is going to be to relocate to Muldra too. That that uh house we grabbed. So I don't mind this. There's just nothing to do out here. It's such a such a haul to go anywhere. Probably the mic's just Yeah, all good. No. I wasn't like up and <laughs> but yeah I think that'll be the play so I can make multiple trips as well so do I still have the stuff over here no Did I just throw in one of these must have, yeah. I'm just gonna read this for the rest of the day. Should be a secret ending where you get spend schizophrenia medication, and the game just ends, and you find that you really never saw me, so you're just nuts. <laughs> Cabin is that one? Uh, it's the one northeast of Muldra, so if you go to the Muldra farm on the PZ map, uh, and go northeast, or if you go just to Dixie, that trailer park, and just go straight west. It's a pretty nice one, it has an antique oven. just slowly dropping yeah, at some point we're gonna have to start lighting it so that's why it's also like I may just stay here until after winter as well then it's like do I want to stay here for two months but anyway I'm, I'm gonna end here though because it's almost four o'clock and uh, I got shit to do so I will uh, see you guys I would say next week, but I think we're, we're doing community events again, so every Sunday. So I'll be streaming Sunday as well, but it'll be on the uh, members multiplayer server. So new video will be out Friday. I'm hoping to have PZ Cribs out by next week. Stardew Valley 100 day video should be out next week as well. If you're interested in that, keep an eye out uh, or join the Discord because I ping for those. But other than that, have a great rest of your week, guys. I'll talk to you later. Cheers.